Hey Owen Owens shy.
All right, what's good, gamers? Today we're gonna play some GTA 5 roleplay. I um hope you guys are cool with me sniffling a little bit because I'm still getting over this cold with this sinus infection or whatever the fuck is plaguing me. I really don't know. You're not cool with that? I can't believe the stream. Rayla, you got to ban yourself. They get new uh, delivery vans? Like, I know they changed the delivery, but those vans look new. Mm. There were 78s when I uh, status of the 78s would go to started the stream. Uh, we're gonna be on. Sounds like it's still going. Copy. Please may want to check the LSB and article for people claiming the PBSO bombing last week. Oh, fucking great! Hey, Vapors, we have two other uh, big rows to the north of us, please. Say again. There's two bang uh, boys to the north of us. He just wants to go to fucking prison for some reason. God damn. I think Dundee's in prison. Fenrir and so Trojan. So you might want to talk to him or something. That's 51 and 50 him. Wow. Terrorist furries. Ask yourself, have you seen any evidence of smuggling or trafficking? No. Well, that's... That's... That's what tr smuggling and trafficking is. It's it's concealing it. If you were doing a bad... If, if you were... If you were... The, if the entire city knew you were smuggling and trafficking and saw signs of it, you'd be the worst fucking smugglers in the fucking world. Trojan continued to threaten more violence. This isn't a war. There will be no ends. Sanguin will thrive. Viva la Sanguin. Let's see what the video is, has to say. Viva la Santos, my name is Fenrir. You see myself alongside Trojan Horse and, and in the memory of Yager Demon Blonde, we bombed Polito PD. And you see, I like to remind the great state of San Andreas that the thing about betrayal is it doesn't come from your enemies. That's something that I live by, that's something that my people live by. You see this reign of terror? It isn't gonna end even if one of us is locked up, two of us are locked up, three of us are locked up. Hell, you could lock up the whole nation of Sanguine like you have and it won't stop. The great tyranny that is going to come upon y'all. You kill one, and two replace them. You kill those two, four replace them. It is never ending. Viva la sanguine. My name is Trojan. I am one of the bombers that bomb Polito. And I am one of the bombers that are not going to stop them until the message is clearly delivered and read. You ever wondered why the war really started? Why the PD decided to invade Sanguine? Ask yourself, have you seen any evidence of any smuggling of any trafficking no the PD Brian Knight who is no longer a cop has stated that they do have evidence yet we are still yet to see it 1042 for real Here's this the time. Thing about God, these guys are dorks. Bull has come to an end. Also, impound is coming for that black bison. I Every time I'm there's a bull, 
there is always one winner. This isn't a war. There is no end. Sanguine will thrive. Sanguine will live on. These guys could really benefit from a script. You can tell they're just they're off the cuff and it's not working well. People are either six feet on the ground. Four nineteen, I'm clear from the prison. Oh. Well, I guess you're just gonna have to Dude, find out. MV, holy shit. When you put it like that, it doesn't look very good for him. <laughs> it's... I mean, so, someone please get these guys a fucking pen and paper so they can write down their their terrorist message. Because doing it off the cuff is not doing them any favors. It does not seem very articulate or thought through. Also... It is so clear to me. And maybe I'm wrong, yeah, honestly. What the fuck? Who's at the prison right now? It's DOC. Is that in the prison or is that right outside prison? Because I just oh, Miss Bloom is inside the gate. Oh my fucking god. Bloom? Go to prison. Um, Bloom has someone at gunpoint. I can't leave my 95 though. I'm coming. 911 in route. Gabby, is this on channel 5 or? They're on channel 5. Are we no, about? Two. no fucking. What's his location? Still Was last seen on top of cafeteria. Last seen on top of cafeteria. I didn't have a clear line of fire, so I didn't return. I didn't shoot him. Has he right uh, I have all of the lifers and BBMC that are currently up here against the wall. Uh, he also incapacitated one of his own gang. Actually, I think his former gang. So, copy. What do we do? I mean, uh, DOC is going to run. Uh, I'm holding lethal in the uh, airlock. We're gonna listen to DOC or it's their fucking playground. I need one extra individual to come onto catwalk. I'm gonna put the prison in lockdown. 360, let's keep someone, uh, let's keep eyes on these prisoners, make sure they don't do anything, please. Bison. We need to get that uh, DOC is safe and get the medical ASAP. Hi. We need to do it right. 9-11-23. You've been on radio, Spencer? Yeah, I'm hearing. DOC who was held up earlier, I will collect your statement later. Let's focus on this. 10-4. Where do you need active people? Catwalk still? 10-4. Where do we believe the threat is? Threat location is currently unknown. Last seen on top of uh, cafeteria. Yep. Probably 7. It's Dundee Bat. Copy. 911 is on the catwalk. 365 is 23, where am I needed? Um, catwalk. Due to the sheer amount of people and ratio, I'm getting my M4. Jones, go with Bison. Y'all need to handcuff all the uh, lifers and shit. Copy. Whenever DOC tells you to move in, we're not doing anything uh, without DOC's approval. <laughs> All right, prison is put into lockdown. I'm gonna grab my M4. Five on rack shotgun. Currently have no visual in the yard of Irwin Dundee. Description shirtless, his stupid faux hawk, and gray in color sweatpants. What did he use Steel to bat. hit the 13A with? Steel bat. Okay, copy. Alrighty, I'm gonna uh, try to get all the prisoners to move themselves into the outdoor eating area. You said you want me to have them move themselves to the outdoor eating area? 10-4. <laughs> oh, fuck. Coughing. It's harder to mute. I'm streaming. 10-9. Bye. Ten nine. what's your status? Who are you asking? The officer that just was talking. Hey, uh, I got Finley, Finley Milton. He is down, and I have the down DOC guard. They're all moving towards the uh, inward uh, eating area. I have visual two are making it into the eating area. There's a total of seven that could be coming out. Three eating area now. It's a mystery. Yeah. 
Make your way to the outdoor eating area and stay calm. We have a, a little count bit of a six. prison issue. Just stay calm. You said there was a total of seven. Nope, here's I, the seven. I have one more coming to the cafeteria right now. I have one down and one's being put in cuffs by Jones at visitation right now. Copy. Total of eight are making their way to the eating area. All right, can we get one extra individual to look at the prison Thanks, checklist right now? To see how many people five, are currently around. A week. Ninth individual. Ninth individual making their way into the lock. Uh, to the locked-in eating area. Can I just do a shoe at me? There's clowns and shit watching over you from the outside parking garage. I'm gonna guess it could be wrong though. <clears throat> Okay, I'm going to put away my class two and class one. I need uh, I need PD to watch over me on catwalks, so I can go lock the outdoor eating area. Copy, I'm watching for you. Hey, uh, Jones, where you at? Uh, I just grabbed uh, the visitation list. It's uh, 12 inmates. Yeah, it's the clowns throwing come? shoes uh, at the catwalk from the outside. Oh, I see him now. Okay, uh, Jones, come check on this DOC and make sure she's okay. Yeah. We we got nine inside, one injured, so that's ten. Eleven with the Dundee, where's the twelve? Okay, so that's cuffs. all twelve. Okay, okay the clown just ran out to the cafeteria. There's one running out to the cafeteria. Chatterbox and ca yep. We are watching outside the cafeteria. We're not He's going He's running in. back he just ran towards in. us. I just saw him through the window. Towards us being the uh, catwalk people. He's just inside cafeteria. He hasn't exited yet. We're gonna, we're just gonna, we're not gonna move yet. We're just gonna wait here. We're just gonna keep an eye on him. Ron Dundee has a phone, he's plotting out, uh, cover me while I look what he's, he's tweeting out a photo. Alright, 751 is moving to the outdoor eating area, cover me. Okay, I'm covering you, be advised there's a clown inside the cafeteria, okay. he ran out. Erwin we're Dundee watching, we're watching. Twatted a selfie, he's still up on the cafeteria uh, roof, or he took a photo. He might be like underneath the catwalk where you can't see him. Alright, well, uh, I don't think he's up there. I, I see him, I see him. Yeah. Am I shooting him? Down? Down, right? If he's, uh, he give him a chance to comply. Good? Yeah, if he doesn't throw his hands up, and if he makes any fast movements towards you, okay, him, okay. Try to give him a, you know. Fine, you got me. I'm coming down, all right? I'm coming down. You got me. Already, the prisoners are locked in. Carter, go hug him. Oh, my God. You resist. Don't turn around. BD, do you have me in my back? I'm watching the DOC. Already, I'm going to All lock right. the cell box. Dundee's in handcuffs. One little spot. DOC's pretty critical. Are we, uh, are we good to start clearing out the cafeteria and get this clown in handcuffs? DOC is yeah. still in the yard. Okay. Uh, Chatterbox is running to the front. He's, he's running out to you. His hands up. He's not putting his hands up. Shoot his head. Now, hold on. He's locked out. He's locked out where he's supposed to be. He is locked out. If he runs towards the guard, to we're going to shoot him. He's running towards the cell block. He's heading back to south box. He's trying to go into a cell block this block too. He's, That's fine. We He's kind of, yeah, we created this, so don't shoot him. That's fine. Just keep an eye on him. I think he's running towards six right now. What? I don't know if that's where... If the correctional yeah. officer can get to the megaphone and give him instructions to surrender, we don't have to shoot I him. I can try. I can try. He's not at the... The DOC's down on the floor. I'm climbing up the to advise. I don't want to advise. I told him to put his hands up while, I, while he could hear me and he ran off. Yeah, yeah, but if we, we don't know him to have a weapon, there's really no point in shooting him. Uh, he also tried to go where he was supposed to. Yes, he disobeyed, but... Chatterbox, come out of cell block 6 with your hands up. We understand you were locked out of where you're supposed to be. <laughs> Chatterbox, come out with your hands up. We will not shoot you if you comply. We just want you he? to... Is cell block 6 right now? So Bloom saying. Pretty sure I saw the door open whenever I was making a run. Isn't where, where's our DOC guy? Is he on the outside? He's up here on the he's up here on the catwalk again. Okay, okay. Hey, uh, Ending down south. You probably can't hear him inside. Just saying. Recently, okay. Am I clear to move this in past eight DOC? You should get a weak pulse. Not yeah. Yet, but we do need hold on, you can move him. I can cover you. Try box approaches. I'll just shoot him. It's one person. Do you want me and Carter to clear out the kitchen first? Have you not? I thought you ran through there already. No, you, uh, we said we weren't going to go in until we were, he was ready in time. Okay, go in and clear the kitchen. There shouldn't be anyone in there. Hold right, on. One second, let me lock the, uh, lock the cell blocks. 
keep me covered. I'm locking cell block six. Fifty four process Wayne, seventy six person the help out. You didn't send him up, did you? Negative. Ten four. So you guys ran through the cafeteria again. Is it clear now? Yeah, it's yeah, we clear. did. Yeah, yeah. It's clear. Copy, Spence, and I'm coming in now. Okay, now we just need to have an officer posted outside of cell block six if we're certain he went in there, and then we can move at injured people if they're critical. Hey, DLC. <laughs> Send it. Uh, we got Kirk Jerkums coming up to you. He's uh. No, no, no! Don't send anybody up. Don't send anybody up. Oh, he's already in process. Oh, damn it. You gotta read the through in ones, Bundy. Already, 751 is collecting lethals. I'll move the charge. Let's get Kirk under control if he's about to show up here in a second. Uh, the door should be locked, so he shouldn't be able to come through. Yeah, he locked he, he 6, not be... 7. He locked 7 oh. as well. Okay. Yeah, they're both locked, yeah. Firm seven is locked. Three, two, four, twenty three. You want me to grab a M4 shotgun? Uh, no, a pistol should be fine. Okay, uh, one more head count. We have eight inside the heating area. We have one injured, one, two in handcuffs. That's 11, and then we have Catterbox running around here somewhere. What is PD? Tonight. Do what? Say again? Which area says PD cleared? Cafeteria. The cafeteria. Have you guys cleared the visitor visitor center? Uh, yeah, I think I'm good. Okay, well, let's just. If we know he's in cell block six and we don't think there's anyone else out there, then let's just go to cell block six and keep the door in. Copy the DOC here in infirmary. Pretty sure I saw him walk in six, but check any bushes around. He likes to slump and shit. Tim Ward, do we have anybody stationed on top of catwalk? 360. Good. Okay. Since you have the shot, uh, who all here has shotguns? If we don't even think he has a gun, we don't need to overthink this. Let's just go in there and uh, tell him to put his hands up. If he runs towards us, we shoot him. Puts his hands up, he doesn't. Okay. Yeah, I walked by. Alright, go ahead. Touch my radio is probably why. Alright, breaching. Polito uh, Sheriff's Office, if you're near me, don't do now. It's locked. Shower's clear. And we're gonna breach the uh, interior of cell block six. On you. Sheriff's office. Put your hands up, chatterbox. Sheriff's box. office, if you need to put your hands up, do it now. Bottom right clear. Bottom left clear. Computer room's clear. All clear except the library. Clear. We have chatterbox in the library. Bison is going for cuffs. Stand by. Chatterbox cuffs. Ten four. We do have one more individual that was sent up in cell block Kirk, seven. Yeah, in seven, it's Kirk. This is your boy, Lewis Bloom. I, I, it's up to you what you want to do at your place, but I reckon we just leave him in there and let these guys loose when we're good. And just sit tight until further instructions. Mm, negative. If somebody already had a phone and we lost, we don't know if uh, Kirk may have grabbed something. Copy. Dundee has not been served. Uh, he's outside the cafeteria. Do what? Carter, Bison, can you all deal with Dundee? You coughed him, right? Yeah, we can do that. Uh, there's 
Hey, Svensson, thanks for the opportunity in your department. He was supposed to be released. Uh, sure. And he decided before I paroled him, I built him <laughs> I appreciate up, it. parole him and release him off of his hold, and he decided to do that to DOC. So. Can we get two shotguns on Soblock 7, just to make sure? Yeah. Kirk, shortly officers will be breaching Soblock 7. We need you to throw your hands up and not resist. Better box is handcuffed in the middle. Uh, try to de-escalate this as much as possible. He doesn't have a weapon, so. All right. All right, Kirk. This is Polito Bay Sheriff's Office. In here, if you're in here, put your hands up and comply. All right. So block is closed. Shower's clear. Stacking on cell block now. Breach. Kirk, you're in here. Put your hands up. Try to clear the prison. Bay Sheriff's Office. Bottom right's clear. Bottom left's clear. Not in the gym. Up right clear. Up, yeah, upper clear. These doors are locked. You know, I sleep. yeah, you could have just gone to sleep, by the way. I'll go check the AMA list. Copy, and what are we looking for? Uh, a bat and a phone. Yeah, should be on Dundee. Should also be on the cafeteria roof. I'll clear it. Yeah, I have the right phone. Now. I have the phone. I took it off of him and took pictures of it. Documented it. You have a bat? Yeah, he has a bat, too. I documented that. Copy that. We got what we're looking for. All right. 365, I'm moving the individual that was in visitation <clears throat> to the seating area. Yeah, I just treat myself to a slushy. When we come to these things, we have no idea really who's involved, so... Alright. Dundee is next to the um, outdoor eating area. Yeah, I'm just going to search you one more time, and then I'll uh, uncuff you once you're in the, the area here. Dude, what? Keep looking behind me, see what they're talking about. I died of cringe. Alright, uh, DOC, are you good? Or do you need to stick around for a second? Uh, negative. If you can get all lethals out of Gin Pop and just wait around just a little bit, everything should be good. I text you a photo of the uh, stuff you had on them. 10 4, thank you. <sighs> DOC, am I good to uncuff uh, one of the lifers? Do you have anything on them? 10 4. He's in the seating area. Are you layering the slushy? All blue. No layering. We'll not be taking questions on the subject. All blue. Ooh, I bled. That ain't good. Whose is this? That's crazy. Cardistle got his wide body charger from being a trooper nine months ago. 
I know no one wants to take it away from him, but it it's kind of feels like it's insane for one person to keep it. But I don't know. I, I that's kind of why I never like personal cars, to be honest. It's like you're asking someone not to use something they paid for, and something they own. It's kind of a hard conversation to have, right? I kind of wish every car for PD was. I don't know. I mean, I, I get, personal cars are way easier to deal with because you don't have to do maintenance. You don't have to fucking refuel and repair every time if you don't want to because it's your car. But. Really just decided to start coming down harder, huh? Shut up, bitch. Woo! Oh, oh, 9-11. Oh, 9-11. Oh, ooh, 9-11. What the fuck? Is that what I'm known for? <sighs> so, thanks for the uh, sub, by the way, Dirk, from like 30 minutes ago. I missed that. And uh, thanks, Step Pogger. Where the fuck did everyone come from? Bunch of first time chatters? Right. Dude, I can't, I can't uh, stop sniffling, bro. Hop out of I'm still sick. And hop into the intake area where you have all lethal taken out of the area and then wait for the to go ahead and get out of here. Shouldn't be much longer. Oh, what's up? Half viewers? You know, I should have known from the 9-11. Half board. Should have known. It was an unofficial, non-Twitch raid. Raid with a specific message. One of the lifers is still cupped in the uh, <laughs> seating area. I, couldn't get to. I guess it is funny to be known as the 9-11. Oh, Jesus Christ, she's dying. Are all lethal the uh, jump up? No, Carter's still standing there. Carter, you on radio? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah, they want you out of the prison. Yeah, she did. She sent me the meme. I'm, uh, I'm honored to be known as a 9-11 uh, uh, guy, I guess. Give me a second, I'm trying to get out of Gen Pop. Fucking love the rain. Even in GTA, they do a bang up job. I'm almost there. He's Bob one, she's gonna be a second. Uh, yeah. Am I gonna give these cuffs up? I am in no rush, I still need to deal with Dundee. Please, <clears throat> excuse me, clear my throat, please take your time. I think it'd be funny to use a shotgun from up here on the catwalk, just spray into the crowd. I mean, how many think I could get once? I could probably get like three of them. Oh, I could get, definitely get two. Let's see who they're dancing, that's easy. The rest of them aren't really centralized enough. Maybe the guard? I'm out. EMS to the prison. All right, the guy fell off the garage roof and hurt himself. What's in Jim Pop? Not in Jim Pop, no. All right, you can put Bill in prison and out of lockdown. Has Dundee been bunk flip? Well, he's still handcuffed inside, I believe. Yeah, I got him right here. Don't forget to document and bunk flip him. Um, Unlocked. These two dancing really, you know, just doing their own thing, I guess, huh? I'm not sure how I feel about that. Thank you, everybody. Did you guys think they're European in prison? 360 is here. I'll remain here until Dundee's at one. Alright, just give us a minute. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not rushed. I'm just letting y'all know that I'm still remaining here. 365 is transition channel. I'm gonna get on catwalks to watch your, uh, when you, while you okay? And 9-11's on the catwalk, I'm just supervising, making sure they don't kill you. God, I love the thunder. I wish it was raining like this right now. Oh, okay, with these three, these close together, that's definitely a... I could definitely hit all three. Wouldn't kill them. 
I'm gonna take Dundee and get him back with. Find the wheelchair to give me. Don't know how to respond to that. I think some uh, awkward silence is necessary. That's the perfect response. Do the Silas thing? Jesus. If only I had thought about that. You know, I can confidently say I've never worn heels. But I have to imagine dancing in lingerie in the rain is probably harder in heels. I believe he has a bunk in cell block six. <clears throat> like this guy's got no shoes on whatsoever or maybe he does i really can't make it out there might be flesh colored shoes and then she's got platform boots on i think or possibly heels that aren't rendered I thought you could freely take Bear's ideas. I absolutely can, I just wasn't fast enough. Yeah, I kind of wonder if they're talking or not. Now I'm just, now I'm curious what they're up to. Entered cell block six, about to do a bubble. You don't think they're talking to each other at all, Sandy? You don't think they're like chatting? Look at them down there, like criminal ants. If the commands who has passed got to shoot like them fish in a barrel, then why shouldn't we? Wow. It's like a poem, isn't it? Thank you for that. Thank you, laying out. I mean, I don't think I would kill a whole group of unarmed people if given the opportunity. Yeah, maybe if it was like a, you know, like maybe it's like an Arthas and Stratholm type situation in which they were all about to turn into zombies and I had to do it to save the city and my kingdom. I would. Probably. I know which two I'd start with, before like that. And that would be the wheelchair user and the clown. Can't trust them. I'd start the two dancing. Really? You wouldn't want to leave them last? You still have your lethal? Covered in everyone else's blood? When you get to get him there, uh, go ahead and, un and unlock the people out of uh, the outdoor seating area. See, Sandy knows. Sandy knows the meta. 
Those two are in an animation. They pose no threat to us. to parole and bill Dundee on Bill Singh's request. Uh, I got him billed, and then he said, one thing before I get paroled, Bloom, and I said, well, yes, Mr. Dundee, and he turned around, pulled out a bat, and beat a DOC and a BBMC member with a bat, and then fled, and here we are. Hey, friend. Hey, uh, I was just rolling by, and I think I spooked somebody out of the bushes. Um outside of the prison they drove off in a silver sedan yeah there's been a lot of clowns on top of that warehouse you're next to throwing shoes at us in fact i think there still is one a firm that may have we been also in yeah we just got in a chase with the clowns two of them that got away or i need here i don't even think we bothered putting out warrants so they probably think they have a warrant okay doc from three two four who send it uh, can the DOC, uh, got hold up on the, uh, 311 so I can call? Yeah, that's me. Um, Erwin Dundee is at the motor pool gate. Don't unstop him yet. Let Bloom do it. Sorry, I was, uh, having a discussion. Uh, have me do what tonight? Erwin Dundee is at the motor pool gate. Yeah, um, so, genuine question, this isn't me being snarky, sniffy, are we just gonna let him get away with doing that shit, or am I sending him up for assaulting two people? It's um, up to you, because normally, if they're already in prison, uh, whatever they do, we send him in the ad when they do something, but his time is over, so it's, it's up to you. If he's not in the pri uh, prison's hands, then he was in your hands. You know, if they if they serve their time, then we'll push them out. I, uh, uh, if you want to charge them for it, you can. So. Here, I guess I'll leave it up to the DOC that was assaulted. Do you want to deal with Irwin Dundee longer? I don't want. I want him out of here. All right. Yeah, the I'll way I've always dealt with it. I'll charge him for it, and then uh, he'll just get paroled and billed, and then you he'll be out of your fucking air. Sound good? Ten four. The way I've always dealt with it is if they hit a cop, and, they get charged. Uh, if they hit a guard, uh, up, the guards have made their. Uh, Stands pretty clear on what they can and can't do. Uh, I agree with that. However, all of them have different stances. I feel, and I hate. I, 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 I hate all I know, right all I know is guards through. can't charge people, and they just they can't yeah. do it. So that's obviously second, above my head uh, even. But I know if they, I, I, I can charge people. So if they hit me or any of my cops, they're getting charged, and that's just what I go with. Well, I mean, we can like. It's just we can't legally keep them here longer than like. Well, that's why you would additionally point. charge them more, because then they would yeah. be remanded here. Now, if a cop is here, then yeah, then, like press charges and like that theory. But yeah, I don't know. But well, I personally just get him the fuck out of here. We gotta talk about what would happen to Juno, by the way. Apparently. Oh, so. I'm sorry you got dragged into it, Sheriff, but uh, I'll gladly do that after I. Yeah, yeah I'll be just out of prison. Uh, wrap this up, all right? Yep. You want me to take Frost into the motor pool? I'm on my way. No, I mean, uh, Dundee. Just leave him there. 360 started a report. I am going to make my way down safely like that. And then I'm going to, uh, come bill him. Tempo. What is he in P7? I don't know. Didn't seem important at the time to ask. Nat, no, 704 41. 10-4, welcome aboard.
Hey, once you wind it down, you can't get it back up. Hello? Hi, it's Aurora. Hi, Aurora. What do you need? Um, I was wondering if I could talk to you about some of the divine stuff. Yeah, I figured this would happen. How long do you have? I probably will only be around probably another hour max. All right, can I call you back? Um, I gotta deal with two other things first, and then I'll. Yeah. Cause that's probably gonna take the rest of my night. Okay. Yeah. No problem. Yeah. I'll see you. Bye. So last night at five in the morning, Tessa called me and uh, Chief Reed in, in character, and uh, told me. Owen Svensson and Maddie, Chief Elizabeth Reed, about apparently Jaeger has a new plan that he doesn't know we know or something, that he wants to go public about the bomb in Divine's neck and uh, wants to try to like force our hand or something. And so we talked about that for about an hour or so. In the end, I think my conclusion is I don't think it, it doesn't, like, <clears throat> like, what are we going to do? Like, how can we ever, as much as we love Divine as characters and we, we, we don't want him to get hurt, we can never let him out of prison with a bomb in his head. What's up, Wookie? And uh, we can't take the bomb out ourselves because he'll probably die, like a 90% chance he'll die. So it's just like, it, there's like no way to, it's like a, it's such a weird threat to make because it's like, what are you gonna tell people? That the ex-cop bomber who has a bomb in his head is gonna be, like you're demanding that guy gets out of prison? Like I know the people of, um, the people of Los Angeles are pretty fucking insane, right? Like generally speaking, the civilian populace of Los Santos are pretty much psychopaths on gen uh, generally speaking, right? But are they so fucking crazy that they would want a ex-cop who we know to be a bomber and a terrorist on the street with a bomb in his head? Why would they want that? Why would anybody want that publicly, the pressure? Why would a crim even want that? He's an ex-cop. They don't trust him. That's what I do. So, I don't know, I guess I'm just thinking, like, what does Jaeger want from this? That's okay, what I kept saying. Uh, I was like, what does Jaeger see in this? My statement. Where is your uh, just make a... So I can call you, please. 10-4. What is going on here? So like you kind of got us stuck there. I don't want to talk about this. You know, it wouldn't happen if you used the parking spot. Well, you know what? You would have some fucking attitude right now if you just mind your own business. Okay. Yeah. Can you help me out somehow or something? Is something Absolutely like not. You're one cop in attitude with me. I'm going to sit there and watch you. In fact, I can just sit right here too. Does this help? You know what? You know what? I would love you. Mormon love, okay. can you well, now you're going to jail. Love you. Mormon love, can you hang up? To you. Mormon love you, can you hang up? Shots fired outside of prison. Guy just stole. He just jumped in the passenger seat of my car and stole my police explorer. I'm going to channel two. Do we have an ongoing active? Someone just stole my fucking cop car at prison. They pushed me out, driver's seat, and stole it south down on Los Angeles yeah. Freeway. It's a. BCSO, Police Explorer, no light bar. I have it, or just pass me south. Yeah, the feel free to open fire on that guy. He just ran up and pushed me outside the car and stole it. Was he wearing a gray trench coat? Yeah, he's wearing a trench coat and a bucket hat. Yeah, it's gonna be Wayne Freeman. I just wrapped up talking to him. Track it, Vincent. Uh, yep, send my. Oh, he just. Oh my god, he just broke my ankles. <clears throat> He's gonna be southbound on Elgin, I think. I'll be there. I'm gonna try and intercept him on. Let's go, Chief. Stand by. 
It looks like he got off on the Elgin last tracking. I'll update in a second. Copy that. Coming from Thanks for the uh, 26 Elgin. tier 1, dude. Holy shit. Too bad I got fucking pushed out of my car or as it happens. Starting to go west on yep. occupation. If I did that, I'd go to jail. Yep. Do you take the bike or do you want to ride? Well, it's this guy's bike who just fucking kicked me out, so I'm going to impound it. Okay. Trying to Can you give another update on that, Switzen? Uh, north on Baytree Avenue. North on Baytree Canyon, sorry. Copy that. 6576. Make sure you're an A. Plus. It's an Explorer, right? Hey, firm. Yep. Copy. Uh, Jones, try to go north on Sonora Road. Copy that. Probably be even with it. <clears throat> it heading back to Route 68. Yeah, it looks like, uh, Smith said they might be going north. Pushing directly behind it, I'm going Are you, uh, street. trying to give me a ride or are you waiting for someone in prison? Uh, if you want a ride, I'll give you a ride. If not, I'm just making sure you don't get dumped here again. Just because we're good. Oh. Alright. You want to help chase him? I can try to track yeah. him. Yeah. For 68 stuff? Or, uh, sorry, not the sound base i have to speak up a little bit, you're a little soft-spoken. Northbound Bay Tree? Uh, now it looks like he's on, uh, South Power Street in the alleys behind the vault. The radio that in. Uh, last tracking is south of the vault in the alley, in between Alta and Power. Sorry, not Alta. Uh, in between Power and Alta. Copy that. Who's the two gifted, Olsen? Uh, westbound West Eclipse. He's still in the alley between Power and Alta, one block south of the vault. Okay, yeah, I am coming back now. Five's on Clint. Here's to be stationary in that area. Oh, yeah, so website September gifts ain't even 25%. What? Hope you enjoyed your vacation, though. Seriously, thank you for the gifted. <clears throat> Trying to... Um, bracket again. Yeah, it looks like Tessa's on it. I got eyes on it. It's uh, abandoned in the alley here. He only has like a minute lead on you. He's probably in the area hiding. Yeah, well, Tessa has we eyes have on it. I have eyes on it, too. I didn't have my canine with me. Sorry, Sosa. Uh, oh, no problem. Does anyone have canine in service? Of the black bucket hat, white male, face paint, uh, trench coat, dark, olive green or black. Wayne it's going to be uh, Wayne Freeman. <laughs> Dude, colonoscopy so surgery. Hope you're okay, man. It's no joke. I'm going to go out on foot. I'm going to look uh, north all the way to the vault. 365's clearing ammunition on uh, Spanish. Check that parking garage on the right. This goes up. I'm gonna jump out. Walk up it. Copy that. Can you check the bolt, the inside of the bolt? Copy. There's a five. We're checking a rooftop uh, just to the north of where the car was dropped. Find the rooftop. The rooftop south of the car. Check is the there. other rooftop to the right. Five 
Dive's entering gold now. What? Uh, you want to speak to me? Yeah, someone stole my car outside of prison, so I'm dealing with that. I'll talk to you yeah, in a bit. He may oh, have had, like, right. a bike yeah. or something stored back here and just took it and left. I'd bet I'd bet a lot of money he's on the rooftops around here. There's a shit ton of ladders. So? Yeah. I'm looking up here on the rooftop I'm on. I see at least six access to rooftops with ladders. Alright, let's keep looking then. Alright, so I just checked the building to the north of where the vehicle was found. There was uh, three ladders you pull up. I did not see. Checking to the west, northwest, on those rooftops. Stand by. I think he just ditched it. I think he wouldn't have come to prison to get his bike out. I'm gonna be honest, I feel like 100% certain he's here. Because the only reason he came to prison in a stolen car was to get his bike back at prison, and then he stole my car. So I don't think he has a vehicle laying around here or he wouldn't come to prison in the first place. Ammunition yeah, that's fair. Southbound clear. City bolts clear. Yeah, I don't really do night streams much anymore. Ring. Feel free. I mean, he knows we're looking. That's not gonna hurt anything. All right, so Maple and I cleared the parking garage, and then who else cleared the skyscraper with the fire escapes? Uh, I am. I don't know which building you're talking about, but I am on top of a building directly across from the vault that has a bunch okay, of fire yeah, escapes. Okay, yeah, that's the one. What got you on late? Uh, I've been waking up late as fuck. I do not see him. So I wasn't on for restart. I've been sick. I've been fighting a sickness in my heart. And it's not the one that makes me play GTRP. It's an entirely different one that makes me physically ill. So I'm kind of getting over that. And I haven't really streamed since last week when I felt really sick, but I had to. League question? Well, you, want play, you want to F8 quit and play League right now? Is that what you're asking? Coming down. Yeah, I feel a little better. I've been getting better steadily over the past four days. I just get fast the sickness. No, League is the cure. I feel like he's around here, for real. I mean, I think he probably ran and tried to steal a car or something. Hey, Redmond, come back to the car. There's not many cars on the road here, so I just don't know 76. where he went. Fisher Dundee just gotten out of prison as well. They may have taken a car and picked up away forever. Dundee was at prison when I was raiding you guys in. He didn't have time. They were in our car. All right, guys, good luck. I'll call it. I'll take it easy. Uh, 450, 1042. 360 will take his place. Where do you need me? We're just canvassing the alleys behind the vault for a guy who elbowed me out of my fucking squad car and stole it at prison. You assume that the uh, car's in our possession then? Yeah, he abandoned it back here somewhere. Copy. Yep, I made Carter 42, and you're next, Annie. Watch it, buddy. Why Sheriff Car get stolen? I cry. Did you touch yourself at night, John Dabrowski? That's why. God knows. And that's why I'm in my car stolen.
Bosch deal. <coughs> <laughs> I'm sure he touches himself throughout the day, not just the night. So Wrong. Just, I just got off the phone with him. He most likely isn't in the area. He's heading to a meeting with Tommy Puff. Did he take a truth serum or something I'm not sure about? Uh, no, he accidentally got out of the car and the, he couldn't get back in and turn it on, so he bailed. Yeah, that I believe, but I, I don't know that there's a car around here waiting. Maybe got a ride from a friend, but the user cleared to break off. I'm going to keep looking for a bit longer. Yeah, I'll keep looking with it. Bosh, man. Watch out. I'm behind you. I've been behind you to horse around. Don't do it, hot. Oh, is this still interval? <coughs> Nine three two ten eight. Sixty's gonna check inside of pitchers. Maybe he ran into a storefront or something. Six five's clearing the apartments to y'all south. I have an embossed man own that office. Are we ever gonna play Wild RP again, John? The Broski. Can you fire Ringo and force John to make Ivan his next cop? Dude, I've been telling John that I, I hate Ivan. I think Ivan's my least favorite character. Whenever you want, I just can't stream on this PC. We gotta get you a new, we gotta get your fucking PC fixed, man. Ever gonna play Baldur's Gate 3 again? No. Sorry, yeah, I mean, I mean, sorry, yeah, you got me. I misread that. I think Ringo is the worst character. I, I don't like Ringo. Oh, I, I don't think he's a bad character. He's just an abrasive one, and I don't like it. Only I get to be the abrasive character. Ivan's cool. Yeah, what's with, what's up with Baldur's Gate 3? John, the people want to know. It actually doesn't matter, though, because uh, I'm just going to play Baldur's Gate with Raven this weekend. I had a car circle the area twice. It's going to be a two-door vehicle. Big Night has quit. What you mean? I'm going to pull it over. Yeah, but please. we could talk him into it if you had a working computer. I know we could. I know I could get I know I could get Nidus back in if you could play. Black color white body draft are occupied two times. Stand by. I plan to talk him in on a new PC. A yeah, that's right. what I'm thinking too. Anyone know what to record to? I'm thinking I'm thinking we just pick it up in like a month when everyone's forgotten. It'll be a huge revival. We'll just make Nidus do it at gunpoint. And dispatch, thank you, 276 MRPD response to inspired. Same change. Mm-hmm. 365, traffic's clear, westbound eclipse, not with. You just gotta keep looking. We all play them in- Yeah! Apparently that's a good idea. The shots at Mission Row were a Impala shooting at a tow truck. I like that. Passing going south and on Adley. And they took a left going eastbound. That's according to BD Tow. Was it another PD tow driver or? Negative. Yeah, make make our Baldur's Gate characters. <coughs> Sorry, make our Baldur's Gate characters in GTA, and then finish our campaign. This would be a crazy hiding spot right here. I am. 365 as well. I did go and get the scout. I don't know if uh, you want me to bring him up there. Happy to have him. 
Uh, I'm not gonna make anyone else come to this. I'm just looking. Cleared pictures. I might swing down to uh, where they stand off Imagination and see if I can't see. I mean, if I see a large group, I'm gonna assume they know Dundee's safe. Hey, hey Firm, he Dundee's out of prison. Cause he said he wanted to go up there. I guess he's got a prison girlfriend. I said, oh, Dundee. He goes, no, he's out of prison now. Yeah, I'm sure Kaban would be totally cool with the big Meech using his model for a Baldur's Gate 3 character. That's alright. Are you trying to kill yourself? There it is, never mind. Video traffic clear. This rain is crazy. I love it. Uh, is there a reason that some bus properties are on lockdown? Um, that could have been involved with a raid from, um, Han Helsing. Han uh, Helsing? I would look at the recent report there involving bank boys. And uh, see if, he, if he's already committed it, it could be a mistake. Um, but let me know uh, if he was the one raided. So you're saying it should be because of the Dundee raid? Uh, it was, uh, I don't know if it was Dundee, it could be related to that. Yeah, because the, the war on Dundee's raid doesn't have that property locked down, so. I'll be reach out to somebody in, uh, MCU, see if there's a pending search for it. I'm on the way, where? Westbound, approaching Adley, uh, all now southbound, all to... Is it actually? Can I make Clon Belson the lieutenant at PBSO? Yeah. 601, 10, 40. Good morning. Seems to have stopped on Alta Street. Might have gotten into a vehicle here. Yeah, it's possible. It's uh, it's also raining, so it's gonna be hard for him to get much. To the Evil line. Johnny! I'm gonna ask Johnny in character about that email you just sent. You can't stop me. <laughs> so, 23 to last known location of the 99. Get a code 6 around the area. If I get a Magneto that. helmet to stop the bomb, yeah, that would probably work. Why do you want Divine to die? What's wrong with you, Sani? to die for years? What did he do to you? Alright, 601 in an active 80, the green and colored uh, Tubrick, I believe is the name of the vehicle, uh, emerging south from Grey Garage towards uh, Vespucci Boulevard. Traffic, light, weather, rainy is heck. Uh, continue I've been alive Vespucci. for like 28 years. And right, that's Santana. a long time. Do you want me to die, Sandy? IRL? Please say no. 
Alright, we spear need example. Infantry attaching. ERP in the evidence locker. Divine's just a furry now. Yeah, I saw the video. Not good for Divine. If Svensson thinks that Divine's a furry, he's probably just gonna execute him. Fuck you, furry! Flap, flap, flap. Replaced Owen and got a new best friend. Yeah, I kind of suspected when he gave me the best friend keychain that he was done. Thanks for the sub, by the way. The hobo. Oh, how tragic! They threw down the kings of the vault, kings of the city, chain gang poster. This would be a crazy hiding spot. Transition east, man. Elysian Fields Freeway, full sending. Ooh, crazy right hand peak. Divine is not king of the city. I've heard it's the circle guys. Whoever those are. Transitioning north man, Elysian Fields. Slowing, slowing. Left westbound labor. I'm starting an investigation into this inner circle shed. I need to get to the bottom Just of it. Out on labor. You turning? Who is doing this? And why are they including me? When I don't even... Hard joke. I was joking about it in John's stream yesterday when I couldn't get on Sledge as a prio. But how the fuck am I going to be in the inner circle? And I don't even have priority to fucking play Krim. This is a shit inner circle. I want a refund. Alright, I went to 13 Beach. Check this shit out. Yeah! Easy. Uh, gonna be transitioning southbound Laqueta. Oh, uh, 20 they're jumping back onto Del Perro. Uh, spinning out on Del Perro. Worst inner circle I've ever had the South displeasure of being a part of. Someday I'll get it, probably. Crossing on the freeway, Johnny, off the freeway. I'm thinking about Lower saying the thing that I, sh I agreed I wouldn't say. Fuck, how do I get down? Am I jumping down? Oh, there's a fucking walkway right, there you gotta cross on. No, I can't say it. Too many viewers. It'd be too it'd be too Operation much drama. Stand I can't do it. Right, northbound standby. Calais. But it would be funny to say it. John knows exactly what I'd like to say. And it would be funny. It's just not worth it. I know. Yeah, you do. Not this kind of drama. This kind of drama probably gets me 
removed from whitelists. That kind of joke I'd make would be the end of me. Oh, they're trying to steal my car. Hilarious. tried to steal my car. I just left it here. For what, five minutes? You think it's bombed? Oh, they probably tried to take it, but it was locked. Sterling? Yeah. Alright, um... I'm sure he will show back up. Oh, they usually do. He's pretty easily found. Yeah, they usually do. I was gonna say, um, Bundy sent someone off to prison earlier when there was a lockdown going on. And then he went off duty before I could talk to him. Um, oh, okay. I'm sure he knows he messed up, but I was gonna give him five strike points just to reinforce okay. it. It's up to you if you want to yeah. do that or not. I'm probably not gonna remember tomorrow, so. No worries. I will, uh, take care of it if I see him again. Alright, thank you. Thanks All for the right. help, too. Yep, no problem. What was that? I think that was Bloom's number. I don't know who that was. Maybe it was Aurora. It's... Man, Svetson's got to start saving phone numbers. I don't even recognize these. So where uh, Bloom's 13B is, Wayne is down here. Wayne is down here? Yeah. Like I didn't do anything. We had medics here, and all the bang boys are here. Sorry, I'm not so gonna, it would be yeah. a huge thing to try to. Bring That's fine. Up. We'll get them later. I'm not. Okay. I'm not gonna right. get thirteen. You know, thirteen, thirteen, just for a fucking arrest on a stolen car. Okay. Okay. That's kind of what I was thinking, but yeah, I wanted to let you know in case you were still looking. Yep. All right. Bye. Bye. Well, there it is. We know where he is. He's just surrounded by like six gang members and it's going to be a whole thing if we try to arrest him. Oh my god, look at the deer. Is there a repair station up here? I thought there was. But I actually realized I'm just driving. Oh, there is. Nice. Throw Divine's head at them like a frag grenade. You know, that's the best Divine bomb head joke I've heard so far, actually. Zoom Divine's head like a, uh, a fragmentation grenade. It's pretty funny. I like that. The problem is, I think if you cut off his head... I mean, I'm not asking for John to tell me, to be clear. But I'm, I'm kind of curious. Do you think... You know, abstractly, as viewers, do you think if you cut off his head, the bomb would go off? Like, if you cut below it? Like, do you think there's any way that the bomb is checking to see if he's alive? I assume probably not. So you could technically use it like that. You would just have to also get them to detonate it, you know? Like, that's the hard part, is that you could throw it at someone, but, like, how do you make sure it blows up? It's got long wires down his back. I think they put a lot of wires down his back into the grounds. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. A dead man switch? I was thinking about that, but a dead man switch is usually mechanically... Um, it's usually in your hands, right? Like a dead man switch traditionally is something you hold in your hands and if you let off pressure, it blows up. It'd be kind of hard to do it like in someone's brain. I guess maybe you could like tie it to their heartbeat or something. Hire Messi and RP to cut the head off and let him kick it. Wow. I think we might have a winner. A winner for the divine perma, most creative divine perma uh, setup. I really like that actually. Um, 
a second. I'm trying to do something. Just trying to. So what I have to do tonight is um on duty. I have to call Aurora. I did the Tessa thing about Bundy, and then Bloom. Now I'm trying to decide which one I want to do first. Get the real Messi to RP Messi. That would be crazy, honestly. If we could get Messi on here to kick Divine's head off his body and into like Jaeger's lap to kill Jaeger, that would probably be RP clip of the year. Oh, you got Wayne in custody. What the fuck? They got him in custody? This is nuts. Sean wouldn't permit that. Yes, he would. Yes, he would. He loves Bessie. Good days, Lexington. Seven two three. Great news. Uh, he's to recharge with dating. Rands. Uh, joy riding. And and the reason my vehicle has been just done in. Here we go. Great news, we got him. He only watches American sports. Yeah. Hey, it's Vincent and Jones. Yeah, I just threw in we one got... back. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Oh, Jesus, the timing on that. Mm -hmm. All right, that's exactly what I was calling about. All okay. right, thank you, sir. Bye bye. Yep. All right, perfect. I don't think that was Jones's, uh, I wonder if Jones got him, you know? I could kind of sense, I could kind of sense through my RP intuition that Jones was really trying to prove himself back there. Um, that he really wants to, he's really thankful for his position in PBSO. That he thinks he owes to me, when in reality he owes it to fucking Stubble. I just okayed it. But, uh, you know, I appreciate the roleplay of him trying to impress a sheriff. That's good roleplay. And I always caught the guy, and I would say he's gonna put him in jail for stealing my car. That's huge. I am currently, hold on, this might be weird. <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna, you know what guys, since the El Pollo Loco bounty went so well, and uh, this is gonna sound confusing, but because the El Pollo Loco Twitch bounty ad went so well, I'm gonna do another one. And the reason I'm doing this one is because I've already accepted it, and there's a third one I really want to do because I think it'd be really funny. I think you guys would actually enjoy it, unironically. So, I have to do this one to get to go on to the next one, unfortunately. So, I'm going to do this. It's, it's a two-minute watch Gen 5 or Gen V on Prime Video. So, this is it. Do the grind rap. Yeah, exactly. So, they want us to watch uh, two videos. Um... They send them through Dropbox, and uh, this is what we're gonna do. It's loud. It's a little loud. I might have to turn this down slightly. I don't see a Dropbox. You know what? I trust you, Cookies. I trust you. <clears throat> oh yeah, there we go. Perfect. Hero. It's not what you think. Like a full screen. You are like, 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 like you're made of steel. Me. All right, we're gonna go back. Being a hero. It's not what you think. You all act like you're made of steel. Made of steel. Only on Amazon steel. Prime, guys. Only on Amazon Prime. But you're not. There are evil people at that school. If the woods is exposed, we all have a potentially fatal problem. So what are we gonna do? We're superheroes. Wait, is this actually talk? in right? the boys universe? Get it, got it, good. It's gonna be a show or a movie? I'm actually there's another one I have to watch, so that might answer. Mm. Welcome to God You. We've trained the best and brightest young talent. Golden boy. Only on Amazon Prime, that's right. Jordan. Oh, I want to go back. Welcome to God You. We've trained the best and brightest young talent. Golden boy, Andre, Jordan. They're going all the way. I'm going to be number one. Classic superhero story. You could be the first black woman in the seven. <laughs> I'm not here to do keg stands. I'm here to be a hero. Okay, it actually looks pretty decent. I wasn't sure. Uh, I wasn't sure I'd like it, actually. It actually looks pretty good. 
it's in the it's in like the um the boys universe which is i don't know what are they gonna call that i think i call the boys verse that's uh i think i call it the boys verse that's that's actually a hilarious fun phrase at the boys verse but i um i actually would watch that and i have amazon prime so i'm gonna be watching that anyway that's the uh that's the extent of the um what they wanted me to watch so and the tracking and now we're done i think it'll go back to my regular title or something presumably okay but now I've got to accept the other bounty, and I'll do that next time I stream. Because I, I have to accept, I can only accept one bounty at a time. So. Uh, hold on. Nice. Okay, good. So I've got that one lined up for next time. Anyway, thanks for watching that. Appreciate it. I um, honestly might have shown that on screen. They, they paid me for something I might have done already, because it looked pretty good. But, uh. Anyway, all things through. I need to call Bloom and Aurora, and we're going to play a little bit of phone roulette. I don't know which phone number comes back to which. I think this one's Aurora. I think this one's Bloom. Bloom's going to be shorter, I presume, and Aurora's going to be until restart, presumably. Hello. Uh, you done with your tripping and falling and shit? You want to talk for a sec? Sure. I'm at the ranger station, so... You uh, cut out at the one important part. Where are you? The ranger station. I'm right. Next, I'm actually right around the corner. See you in a minute. Yep. See you then. I figure blooms will be shorter but long. The bloom talk has got to be about Juno and why he wants to suspend her. My in character, my 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 Svensson perspective is that. Uh, I'll refresh. There we go. Um, my character perspective is that uh, I want to back my sergeants really hard, about like everything I can. Because that's something Svensson always struggled with with Toretti being high commands, was he didn't feel like he got supported when he made kind of like not crazy decisions, but like extreme ones. And so Svensson wants to have Bloom's back big time. But also it's been brought up like six times in the past twenty four hours, so I feel like I should know about it, even if I'm not gonna you know over talk you know, overrule him or something. So what's up? What's your beef with Juno? Someone tell me about this shit for. Um, so what's with the MP7? Uh, being uh, it's intimidating it makes people not pull guns on me. Is it working? This one? The MP7. No. Do I have one that works? Yes. Okay, and you're not going to use that on duty, right? I don't know. Hello? No, uh... Even though the under sheriff uh, told me I should, I uh, I've learned my lesson. I've ruined should? it once. Uh, you should use the MP5. Uh, the seven. exact quote was, "I want to make sure that's the that's one that works." So I mean, doesn't that kind of imply it, sir? I think you're you're reading that exactly how you want to, which yes. is he was probably saying, "I hope you're not carrying around a broken gun for no reason." No, that's what Mueller said, sir. That's not the under sheriff, to my knowledge, unless I I know sleep yeah. promoted someone. Yeah, but I'm saying that's Mueller said that, and then Stubble turned around and said I wanted to make sure that one was working. Okay, listen, you know, I I was telling some people about this last night. So you know, actually, I was telling your counterpart in the SDSO, Kozlov, who's now wearing a balaclava full time on duty, and I just hmm. said, I know you're going to get in trouble for that, but it's not going to be me. So, you know, my, my perspective is, if you guys want to push the envelope with this shit. I'm not going to come down on you, but when someone makes me do it, understand that, all right? All righty. Okay. What's with this Juno thing? Are you good down there? Do you need me in there? Because uh, I... Do you want it from the top? Do you want... I, I don't need, like, else? a whole... Oh, what the fuck the is this? I added was yeah? Thank you. Hello, sir. How are you? What do you want? Uh, Just wanted to know if you want any updates on MCU stuff. Yeah, hey, I'm all for you. Um, if you want to come to the ranger station in, like, five minutes, I'll talk to you in a sec. I got, I got a few good. questions. I need to do in person. Absolutely. I'm grabbing some pizza. I'll be right there. All right. Sounds good. Bye -bye. Okay. Um, I don't need the whole thing because uh, I don't really care. And, you mm -hmm. know, I've always had the perspective that I want to try to be the high command that I wanted as a sergeant and as a lieutenant and as a captain. And I don't, you know, you made a pretty extreme decision to suspend her indefinitely. But, mm -hmm. you know, you wouldn't be a sergeant if we didn't have a little bit of trust in you, right? So... I don't really need to know the nuts and bolts, but I need to know why people are, like, coming at you about this, you know? Like, so if they come to me, I can at least protect you. 
All right. Uh, the shortened version of it is I had a complaint on Juno. Uh, what I always do is I take that complaint and then I immediately go to that person as soon as I can and get their side of the story. And then I weigh my decision. Uh, in this incident, uh, she gave me her version of events. Uh, she was contradicting a few things that she said. I said, okay, well, this is now the third variation you've told me. I want to make sure that I'm getting your side of the story, not what you want me to hear, not whatever. Uh, I had to have that specific conversation three times in that conversation. So getting her debrief, I had to tell her three times, stop altering your story. No one's in, no one's in serious trouble. Just tell me what happened. Uh, she was openly saying it to me that she was very emotional. It was very clear that she was emotional, that she can't trust the people around her. Everyone talks behind her back, yada, yada. It's a, it's a conversation I've had with Juno many a time. Uh, oh, I thought that's Teredi on his balcony looking at us. Uh, just a warning shot. Could have been. It could have been. But... Well, just a warning shot because he's fucking looking over at us spying. You think you hit a TV? If I shot That's where it really hurts. Yeah, I mean, it's going to hit a TV if it hit the house. That's true. That's actually extremely true. Hopefully not one of the chickens. Uh, so she was explaining to me that she's very upset. Uh, instead of doing the traditional calm down thing that does nothing to help. I just told her that I needed her to lock it in. Had to have that conversation a couple times as well. They kind of went hand in hand with uh, the other one. Saying that she needs to stop changing her story. Uh... The word nitpick get thro got thrown at me a lot, that I was nitpicking, uh, which I think I should do whenever getting people's stories, especially as they're changing it actively. Uh, we then moved on from that discussion about why she was in the office, and we had a conversation saying basically me to her saying, hey, when have I given you a reason not to trust me? I'm someone you've always come to and divulge information to because others won't help you. Uh, she literally calls me when she's off duty. She comes up to me when she's off duty, yada, yada. Uh, so I had that conversation with her. I was like, like, seriously, you're treating me like I don't have your back ever. Uh, I told her I'm not giving her special treatment, but, you know, she, I, I in, need her side. Bloom, Bloom, I'm not your therapist. I don't need point by point. Just Man. why are people angry about this? So I know what okay, to say well, when they come to me. Fast forward, next conversation, she says, why have we... Are you being hostile with me when I wasn't? Uh, Can I just ask, let me just, just ask bluntly. Was she, you came to her about a punitive issue. You asked yep. her to be honest with you and she really yep. didn't seem to be. And you dug yep. deeper and deeper. And then yep. she, and then it seems like from what I've been told from your perspective anyways, is that she dug so deep that she was insubordinate to you and you. No. Okay, no. We got past the problem and then we started talking about another issue. Uh to which she uh, she stated, again, something I needed her to clarify on. The, the exact words were, I believe, you're more than rightfully so looking into the Italians. She said, you're looking into the Italians more than rightfully so. She said that to so that's you? Yeah, that can mean two okay. things. It could mean you have every right to, or it could mean you are out of your right to. So I said, Juno, do you, literally, I think my exact quote was, do you care to clarify that? Uh, she said, why are you nitpicking everything? She then started getting very upset, thinking I was looking for a reason to come after her. She started yelling at me. I told her to calm down, and then I started raising my voice, said, you're done talking to Bloom, you're now talking to your sergeant. Because uh, before you were talking to Bloom, sergeant, now you're just talking to your superior. Uh, she started throwing words at me. I said, the reason that we're talking like this to each other is because you've been a defense attorney to your Italian friends in the past on a scene with me, uh, which has been upsetting me. However, that's not why you're in this office. She then said, I'm done talking to you, Bloom, suspend me. Uh, basically said, fuck you without saying fuck you, walked out of the office. I sat there for roughly 10 minutes. I was deciding a, uh, a suspension link. Uh, I texted her, said five days suspension, or you can come talk to me with a level head before then. We can make amends. I'm not looking for a sorry bloom. I'm looking a sorry that I, disres I, I disrespected you like that. And that's all I'm looking for. She then kept going. I responded uh, saying, I'm not having this conversation over text. And it went back and forth with me just responding. I'm not having this conversation over text. And then I had a panel with Willie. 
How'd the panel go? Uh, seemingly in my favor. Uh, Kovacic was there, and uh, and then apparently we've just got more and more people involved. Uh, Juno has been talking to everyone, which does not surprise me. It's well within her right to talk to whoever she wants about anything. However, other people and other commands and stuff are giving their opinions, and it's mudding everything. And they got overturned today, which is more than in Willie's right to do so. Uh, of course, five days was harsh, which is why I, she could have been unsuspended in 12 hours if she just came in and talked to me. Uh, instead, she doubled down over text and said that she'll just remain not suspended then. And by double down, I mean that would have been quadruple at that point. Yeah. And then I just had the conversation with Willie about how the drainer situation is different because he's a cadet. And Willie doesn't understand that, yes, it's different because we expect more from our deputies. And uh, instead of doing what Juno did, I said, yes, Lieutenant, I accept your punishment. Is there anything else we need to talk about? And I walked away and I, he said, no. I said, all right, am I clear to leave? Yep, bye-bye. <clears throat> and you're caught up. It's a heavy Cliff Notes version since you didn't want the details. All right, that's fine. Uh, you're good to go. Just want this. See you. All right. Here you go. Where came to me, you know? Yep, of course. Jesus, all right. Take care, Sheriff. I'm going to go to that. Radio check. Into. Is that situation on another channel or something? What's going on? 1 8 7 I'm watching dispatch. No cat calls of any 11, 32 is nothing. Hawk is on scene. Tesla's down. Another one down on a boat pad. I don't know where Lexington is. Another place to talk to I'm up, I'm up. Uh, the fat guy is the guy he beat up me and Tessa. The clown's innocent. He doesn't need to be placed in cuffs. He's fine. He defended us. 23. Fat guy. Fat guy. There's a fat guy on scene. I'm telling you, he does not need to be placed in cuffs. Yeah, he's on scene. He's getting oh, onto a moped team. right now. He just got up. Alright. He's getting it again. He, he was down there. I mean, After the guy in the moped, me, uh... he beat both the officers. 1080 officer. South right. Alta with a moped. Adjusters. South and Alta passing the apartments. Still South Alta, 70 miles an hour. Sir, pull over. It's not worth your wreck. Pushing over innocence, South Alta. Be explained, I'm sure. I can't hear you. If you'd like to talk to me, you can stop. I get 52s on Alta. Tessa needs to be looked at. Right, West, South Arsenal. I'll leave you alone if you pull over, sir. You won't see me for that long. Coming across some grass, right in north, you South London. Uh, do I have any sub -wheels? I don't think I do. Oh. Right, he's been kicked off his bike. He's on the grounds. Stopping, sir. Now put your hands up now. Hey, don't reach. He's reaching for something. Hey, put that away, man. I don't want to kill you, but I will. I will kill you. You better put that away. Your hands. Going for cuffs! Going for cuffs! I'm not! I'm not! I lied! I'm not going for cuffs! I'm stuck! Help! Okay, that's... He's back on the moped in North Calais. North Calais past the construction site. Left, Vespucci, west. Yeah, yeah, it's a in his hand now. Sir, just put down the crowbar. Merging right, north of Rockford. Left, Red Desert Ave, westbound. Left, south, on the promenade. Approaching Burger Shot. Left, is Bucci, east. Left, north again, south Rockford. Yes. We are merging Del Pair Freeway, eastbound. Left, north, Movie Star Way. 
Because Moped might have broke. Moped might have broken. He's been clubbed off the moped. He's incapacitated. This time I'm gonna handcuff him. Watch everybody. Hands with your back, asshole. I'll try to learn. I, I'm not a girl. That's how you do it. Fuck! I've been doing it wrong for years. Yeah, the cuffs on him. Damn it! All right. One ninety five. Mm. You get fifty twos off Movie Star Way, please. We don't have fifty twos. Yep. <sighs> Let's just uh. Jesus, sir. Just put put him in my fucking truck and just take him back to the other scene. All right. No sense in having two different scenes for the same thing. I'll just take a picture first. Done. You're good. All right. You rent this thing, asshole. Uh... I didn't rent it, just stop because someone wants to give me a baton. No, did you rent it? I didn't rent it, I found it. Okay, so you stole it. Excellent. <clears throat> Maybe I, no, I have rental papers. I just found it on the road. With the rental papers, right? I'm just trying to figure out if it's a rental or not. Come on yeah, now. There's no You're making this way too difficult. In it. Looks like there were keys in the ignition. Is your ID Charles Malone? Yeah. Mr. Malone, oh. all right. What can't be? We're gonna take the 95 yeah, back to the other scene. We're cleaning up here on the way. Yeah, I need to well, I'm glad you pooped on the ground before the car. Or... Thank you. Uh, I believe they already broke down the other scene. Brought this over to the major. Oh, roger that. Well, we'll just take this guy right to the hospital then. No reason to sit here. 911, 195, and we're out to the hospital. Alex, is there any evidence that we need to collect on the other scene? No, I think he shit his pants. Sorry, is, is there any evidence on that other scene? Did you make a stinky well, man? Well, there's not. He. Yeah, can can I you, did you make a stinky in your pants? You make a stinky in your pants? Yeah. That's gonna suck. It'll make you force you to eat it because it's in my car. <sighs> I'm definitely not gonna eat it. Well, the law says we can force you at gunpoint to eat your own shit if you do it in our car. Mm -mm. That's just what the law says, man. I don't, I don't make the law uh -uh. just enforce it. Uh -uh. All right. Mm -hmm. Can we get cleaned up? Yeah, with your mouth. We'll give you. We'll mm -hmm. have to take you to the hospital first. I'll take you back out to eat it. I'm not eating this shit. No, I don't think yeah. so. Yuck. No. Why am I going through the garage like I'm ramming? Uh, well, this might surprise you. You might very well be a criminal as of right now. What a cabbie. You've broken the law. What law can I break? Uh, I mean, at least reckless of aiding. It sounds like you clobbered an officer too with a crowbar. No, I get it. I'm on a clobber too. Uh, that, you might want to save it for the judge. He does have a resemblance to Toretti in the face. A little bit. Oh, shit. That's my oh yeah! All right. Oh, no. get him. Heck yeah! There he is. I'm sorry. Want to get seated in the bed? Dad. It's okay. I knew it was bound to Bloody, happen. You're back. What happened? Sorry, my other officer didn't listen to He's me. He's the again. one that beat these two down. No, I didn't. The super clown. Thank you, Spencer. Oh, the clowns beat you. Down. Okay. He's cuffed, no. right? Who are, um, oh, right? are we supposed to cuff him? Yeah, of course yeah. I cuffed him. Yes. <laughs> Oh, I just thought, judging from, no, he's cuffed. I was just fucking with you. Uh, please don't. I've had so many cuffs not listen to me today. I'm going to scream. Well, I'm, I'm listening to you. I was just joking you. with you. There's a difference. Thank you. Okay. I'm so sorry <laughs> I hit the two beautiful women off the car. Get what you're supposed to be a clam. He's, uh, he's, he, he pooped himself like six times in the car on the way over God off. God off. Why the fuck would you pay that for the way? Yo, thanks. Wow. We'll keep for another 38. Take you. him in your car now. Yeah. Warm and love you. Can you hang out? <laughs> yeah, I can do that. Sorry to pooped him. Okay, thank you. He's under the ice. Uh, You're the initiating officer. You know what? Uh, give no me problem. just a second. Okay. So he's under the impression that we can legally force him to eat his own poop. So. 
Ew. Wait, legally enforce him to do what with his To eat his own poop. If he poops in our cars, he thinks he has to eat it. That's gross. I am not. Uh, I'm not. I'm not making him eat his own poop. Well, so you don't have to levels. make him. People like this just do it. Yeah. To, uh, taste don't. it again, you know. Please he might. Don't. He might leap at it before I can stop him. Uh, uh, so, uh, Riv, What's this guy shit his pants like six times, what and is going they don't here? really want to. Um, you know, this isn't really a spectator well, sport. Well, Are you a medical professional really or? Touch him either. No, you don't have to touch him. I'll take him down if you get the fire truck ready. Public embarrassment. I want a lawsuit. Civil lawsuit. I mean, it's it's like a biohazard hazard if you touch. It's not up to you. Wait. I have an idea. But, okay, but, Riv's got this. He's gonna okay. clean him up. What about you? Oh, perfect. All right, now let's say mm, it's no foul hazard situation. Okay. All right, sir. Here's what we're oh, gonna do. Away. We're gonna put I, I you in a biohazard barrel. That's okay. We're gonna I gotta make a phone call, but I'm happy to, to transport. Just let me know when he's done. All right, thank you. And we're just gonna give <laughs> you a thorough wash. <coughs> okay, let me call Aurora. Um, which number is Aurora, you think? Right. This is probably... Right. Let me call this one. Let's see if Bloom answers. I'm going to sleep. I'm, 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 I'm so freaking frustrated. No, oh, I wasn't even... Like, the radio was one thing. It was whatever. It was like the bed. But, but Maple... He got up. He got up. And Maple rolled up. And I was like, don't cut the camera. Thanks again for the 30... A total gifted Wookiee. That is insane. Taking us to 400, which is our sub goal for um. What was the sub goal set up for last month? I have to check. Thank you. I'm going to scream. I don't want to have to be a bitch to have people. You know, oh, battle seminar bit. for people such as yourself. Where's he going? Yeah, guys, oh, my going we're, we're, going... we're gonna get him cleaned up. Okay. We're going to the bottom floor. Sweet. We can do some battle bit. Community night. That sounds fun. Is it in the training material? Oh yes, it is. It is. Thoughts on car alarm? I would love to play car alarm if I didn't have to. Currently, oh, do we're this gonna RP. need to move your uh, SUV here. It's okay. It's already. He's pooped in it already. I can just open the door. Oh well, he can. He can clean it up for you then. Just yeah. Just he wants to eat it. Be careful of that. He loves eating poop. I don't know what his deal is. Please don't let him eat it. He's got fecophilia? Gross. Please don't let him eat it. I don't know it. there's a word for it. That's crazy. Yeah, there is. There's a word for everything. Oh, God. Is this safe? He's a doctor. How, how can it not be safe? Uh. He dies? Can you, um. Can you spray the inside of my car, too, while you're at it? Oh, yeah. Door's open. I, got it. Okay, I want to stand back a little bit. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna aim straight at your pants and clean it up. Are you ready back there, sir? I guess no, I'm not ready. This seems like a really heavy duty hose. Okay, yeah. that's probably good. Okay, well, that's good. No, he's a doctor. It's okay. It's okay. There's a ga we have like a pressure system on it. It's on minimum. It's it can't Listen, even blow they away. Just hire body. anybody to the doctors. They have to be medically trained. No, I mean, Riv is, like, is I've excellent. Been, I've been hit with that host before and it threw me against a building. All about the touch you use. That's yes, true, like... I do like it rough. Okay. Yeah, oh, good? Oh, what is this? What is this? But yeah, don't be afraid, man. I what? have a license. What? Is that oh, what he has you a just license? Sent? Yeah. Okay. Is he poop free? We host down the car. Oh, well, there it is. How can you deny this? Congratulations, Dr. Rivington Rivera. In recognition of the superior performance with sounding an outstanding accomplishment, Alleyway Doctors hereby declare Bobby Bolterman skilled in performing the medical duties, trained in medical doctors such as Doug. All right, that works for me. All right, going for home. Very nice. Wonderful. Got a career in car detailing if this ever, you know, this doctor Sorry, thing ever works out. wanted to be what in handcuffs? By a what? Alright, it looks Go. pretty good. I have like... Oh, okay. <laughs> actually, I got some bad news for you. Uh, this handsome gentleman's actually gonna be cuffing you up and taking you down. So your plan of being cuffed by a beautiful woman just backfired. That's have fucking fun. weird, dude. 
No shot. Being pretty weird, man. Hey, you got Spencer. You got a good dude looking good there. You got a good looking dude there doing it. I've been yeah, told that a lot. Dude. You know, I get that an alarming amount. <clears throat> I'll shoot your fucking car. Oh, he cleaned it out, man. Don't worry. Nice and clean. Take it easy. 9-11-76 Mission Road PD-195. You just wait till my brother's here about this. You're going on. Okay, man. You know, I, I can't say I've ever heard any death threat that wasn't by someone currently in handcuffs or behind bars. It's kind of lame that you guys never actually make them when you can execute on them. You always promise it about later, you know? You thought about that? You thought about how lame it is that you guys won't actually make a death threat when you have the means to do it? You always do it, like, when you're in handcuffs or behind bars and you're just like, I swear to God, when when I get out, oh, wait, you're going to see and my friends and I'm right. going to, you're going right. to, and everyone's going to see and, and no one's going to fuck with Go. me anymore. No, I see. We don't do that, right? We You're doing it right make now. Make your life as inconvenient as possible. We're gonna take your shoes, your guns. No. Yes. Wrong. No, you're wrong. You can't say that. I, I just can't. Doesn't you're work wrong. That way. You're wrong. Doesn't work that way, I, man. I'm rubber. You're glue. Whatever you say. My coffee kicks on you. <sighs> I just. I'm wrong Wait a minute. Me? What the you fuck? You didn't even identify yourself. I don't have to. This isn't a Burger King. I don't have to introduce myself. By law, okay. I'm gonna get yourself ass at all, man. I actually don't, believe it or not. That's a, that's a procedure that some departments have, but I'm not required to introduce myself unless I'm on a traffic stop, which we're not. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna go ahead and have your belongings sent up to prison ahead of you. And, uh, get you processed for whatever's going on here. Do you need help with anything, sir? Um, let's see if the other officers make their way down here. We can arrest them. Let me, uh, check out the hallway real quick. I'm assuming they're coming. There we go. Thing. Also, I just picked a bunch of pizza if you're hungry. No, I'm all right. I think I, I had a slushie just now in the hospital. No. The prison rider a little bit ago. Oh yeah, I was I, I was dealing with the uh with kick it and shot over on that other scene. Mm, classic. And bullshit, honestly. Hello? Hey, what's up? It's uh, it's the sheriff. Uh, what charge is this guy getting? Or are you doing the processing? He's at the mission um, row. I can come to the processing. Uh, Bloom and Tessa are just talking in the hospital. Uh, if you want to get starting, it's going to be uh, failure to... Or it's going to be failure to basic traffic control devices, evading, resisting arrest, um, property... What was the original damage. call? Like, how did it start? So I can start the report. It, he just he ran through a red light. He, he went through a red light and then he refused to pull over and then we chased him all the way from MRPD through Mirror Park down to Alta and then he saw a clown and started to beat the clown's car uh, and then he turned his side on us. What a fucking weirdo. All right. Yeah. Um, I can write this up. Can you, uh, okay. if I put up the report, can you just add the charges to his record? Yeah, absolutely. I will be down shortly. Also, I apologize. I um I definitely knew you were the sheriff. I am um, I should have been a little bit more respectful downstairs though. It's okay. I mean I hear a lot worse from a lot of other people. Oh, okay. That's pretty bad for me. So I just I, okay. All right. Now I'm all nervous and my hands are clammy. I'll be there shortly. Okay. The report's up. If you just want to add the charges, I could just I could just do the processing. I don't really mind. Okay, I'll add the charges then. All right. Thank you. What's up? How's MCU? Uh, it's good. Uh, we had our general meeting earlier today after the uh, tsunami meeting and everything and uh, got people promoted, got four new names put forward. I contacted uh, 
Tessa to have him put onto the, the request sheet since I don't have access quite yet. Um, and uh, covered a wide range of topics, kind of let people vent a little bit in the meeting, not too much, but just, uh, you know, just enough to help them see that there's a, a new vision to it, uh, that we're not going to continue this, the same path that we've been on that a lot of people are unhappy with in the unit. What's and the path that you, about, people are unhappy with? Uh, secrecy, confidentiality, <laughs> uh, a click inside the unit that surrounded Brian, uh, a cult of personality as leadership. Okay. A lot of people felt excluded, and it wasn't. Hello? Hey, they're added. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, appreciate it. It wasn't necessarily due to... Um, it wasn't untrue, put it that way. And they had tried mm -hmm. to become involved and were not becoming involved. They were, they were being left out, essentially, and a lot of people felt that. Um, separately, there were... You know, there were issues with people being probationary for months since the beginning of the unit as well. They felt disrespected. They were never given an answer on what their expectations were to progress or if progression was for them because they were told when they were taken on as probationary that if they're not a fit for the unit at the end of the term that they're not going to be kept. So some of them were starting to think, well, shit, if I've been probationary this long, I guess I'm not going to make it. But then they also see that everyone's still probationary. So it was just... Uh, it was good getting that foundation laid out today. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Let me uh, we can put this guy in jail, and then I'll come yeah. back to ask that questions. I don't want to do it in front of him. I seen your back after carrying Buddha zero percent shooting ass, dude. Watch what you're talking about, man. That's the leader of the inner circle. He's gonna kick you out. All right, Charles, listen here. You're gonna be charged with the following: failure to obey traffic control devices, evading. Vandalism of government property, of vandalism, two times attempted murder of a government employee. How do you plead? Guilty. Plead guilty? Yeah. Okay, you're going to be receiving a $13,100 fine and three points on your license. That is non-negotiable. You're going to be receiving 57 months in state prison with 114 months on parole. Uh, you pled guilty, so I'll, I'll call it 40 months. Do you have any questions about your sentence or your charges? Yes, uh, so I'm surprised you're not talking to me when driving under the, or uh, driving with suspended license. Yeah, I'm not. I mean, I'm, okay. I'm just doing the paperwork for someone else, so if, that's, if they don't want to charge you with that stuff, I'm not going to. It's discretion. All right. Is that the only question? Yes. Okay. Have you been to prison before? Yes. You're familiar with how it all works up there? You don't need guidance on how to, like, contact a lawyer or get out of prison when your time's up or find food? Uh, I, I, know the, I know the procedure. Okay. Um, I got to have a few talks real quick, so I'm just going to send you up if there's no further questions, all right? Yes. All right, I'm going to handcuff you just in case there's any issues. And I'm going to radio DOC and let them know you're coming. And you're going to jail for 40 months in state prison, 114 months on parole. Got to go. All right. See you on the other side. PD to DOC, booking one Charles Malone into prison for disorderly conduct and assault on a police officer. Solo. Yeah, just him. What's up? Hey, be biased. He likes to poop himself. Got it. I'm hiding. <laughs> that's that's gross. Yeah, well, is what it is. Um, so the, my question was first question, pretty hard hitting. Uh, mm -hmm. Are there any foreign wars I need to be aware of that you guys are starting? No, sir. No, uh, no foreign wars. There. Well. Just to put it on your radar, there there is an Eastern Bloc terrorist cell that's already been known to the police department called Baba Yaga that uh, I was told today is now possibly back on Sanguine Isle. Yeah, I saw some of the tweets and stuff. So uh, just to warn you, since you asked the question, uh, in context, there is potential for another international incident. But no, the MCU will not be uh, provoking or involving themselves unless directed by high command. Um, you don't have to answer this one here if it's a uh, you don't think like there's enough security mm -hmm. around to ask it. But is there any undercover agents like engaged in anything like deep cover I need to know about? 
none that have reported to me since Brian has left the position. So if he if they are, he left them out there. Okay. Um. What's your, what's, your, what's, your, what's, your, what's the status like? Actually, I, I, can I actually talk to you outside and reference that question or somewhere like the roof okay. or something? Now that I have an actual concern. You know, you feel like driving around a little bit. Sure. Same sure. He's going to kill me. I like the way this looks, by the way, on the Explorer. It's actually it's good. Yeah, well, Axel's uh, dead, so he can't stop me. Uh, so, speaking of Commissioner's past, the one before that, our, our favorite, you know, Bass. Brian took me aside early on in the MCU days and said, hey, I want to run something by you. I want to hear your ideas about it. I said, okay, sure. Kind of put me in that quasi-XO position, right? Like he always did. Uh, even though he never actually gave me the position and then also was disappointed in me when I wouldn't clean up his messes. Anyway. Uh, so he asked me how I would feel and asked me if he, he said, I want you to make a decision. I'm going to give you context and a, and a decision to be made. And I want you to tell me what you think about it. I said, all right. And he went on to tell me that Bass, I believe it was Bass and him. I mean, I don't know whose original idea it was or if it was collaborative had this idea to put Juno Sweeney undercover with the Italians. Who had this idea? Now, Bass and Brian. Now, Bass is dead, so I can't ask him about it. And Brian never gave me any context or follow-up to see if that was the case or if that's what they had done. He asked me, he gave me the decision. Oh, he, no. he painted it very broad. Like, you could, she could die. You could have to wind up working her homicide case where you find her chopped into a bunch of body bags or whatever, blah, 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 blah. Try to give me the trauma, the trauma dump, you know, to, to make me hesitate on my decision. But that doesn't matter. It, that was just a conversation, but it was clearly a, a testing in the waters of like trying to get ideas if this was a, a good or bad or, you know, what, where morals are on. I don't, I don't know. But that's very specific for what's currently going on now. And it's very odd considering some of the behavior that I've talked about. She doesn't about. even seem Italian. She's like, what, British? No, yeah, no, I'm think, just fucking with you. Is she? Do you think she's actually undercover? Or are you just not sure? Know. Oh, and I really don't know. I don't know if something was... There's so much stuff that's been uncovered to me by other people that was going on in the MCU that I had no idea of as a supervisor. And if you were an undercover cop and you couldn't trust anybody, would you blow your cover to even, like, me? You know what I mean? Well... Especially after what she just saw happen to Divine. If she is undercover, do you, you, would you blow your cover? Would you blow it to somebody in the PD after what just happened? I would never say anything. There's no one that could trust, yeah. Because you don't, I mean, she doesn't know the inner workings of like, who fucked her and who, who fucked, she doesn't know who fucked Divine or why they fucked him or anything. Of course yeah, we no. know, but she doesn't know that and she doesn't have any reason to trust us. I mean, I feel like it'd be pretty naive of the Italians to trust a a literal cop, though. Like, and like I mean, she's not even undercover. She's cop. just she she wears her uniform every other day. You know, like that'd be pretty extreme. No. Yeah. But hidden in plain sight. I mean, imagine how powerful that is if it's accepted. Do you actually believe this, or is this more of like a what if? Look, you asked the question. If there was any sort of concern about there still being some sort of undercover operative out there, there, there that's the only thing that crosses my mind. But it is very coincidental. Mm. Do I know for sure? No. Was it brought to me? Yes. And does her behavior add up to me right now? Not really. But, you know, love does make people do strange things. So. Yeah. Careful, it's a little steep there. You know, last time I was out here, really out here though, this guy, I, you know, he said he's my brother. He fell off the dam, it was the damnedest thing. Is he a judge? <clears throat> no, no, different one, different one. Um, anyway, that's not really related to what we're talking about, just haven't been here in a while. 
I don't think Juno's undercover. But I mean, if she was, I mean, who would she tell? Who's she close with? Divine. And yeah. she's not going to tell him, I hope. Me. That's the weird part. She's a good friend of mine. So. Oh, really? But she'd yeah. say, she'd say, right? If you just asked her point you would blank. Think you would think. Mm. Yeah, maybe maybe I'll just do that. I mean, I'm just I wondering, know. like, I don't know what the the answer is. Just ask her point blank and be like, hey, you undercover? Like I said, I got to put it on your radar. I, mm -hmm. I You asked, so. Yeah, I, I don't I don't know. this. I mean, it sounds like a bass idea for sure. And it is strange that she's apparently hanging out with them. But stranger things have happened. Can I tell you the weirder part? I told Brian that my idea for her to do that, if I were to ever make the decision to actually put her undercover with them, was to not have her do some sort of random big flip, but to slowly erode her own career away in the public vision until she's accepted by them. <clears throat> the exact Look, thing that she's doing oh and it's really fucking yeah i'm not kidding man this isn't like a haha -ha, like i'm kind of worried that these that this got fed back from brian and this actually is happening and she's not gonna tell Did she us know any of this she does she ever hear this plan yeah i asked her she uh -oh. actually brought it up to me just the other day too in the hospital but you know Did she maybe i mean it could be i need to ask, oh and i need to ask her. i need to sit her you've down asked her because it seems like she might be like, like yeah subconsciously yeah. or consciously like engaging in my goal before yeah. 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 I'm worried. I'm at, like I said, this isn't like a funny haha. I'm, I'm telling you that this was in my purview and I don't, I don't know if it's actually happening. It's to the point where the information I've gotten about the unit and what some of what Brian was doing and not, not revealing to everyone. It, it makes me believe that this could be a reality. Yeah. We, I mean, have you told anyone else that, about your suspicion? No, because nobody else has asked yet, and it hasn't really come up. Until, nobody else like, has asked such an obviously time. stupid question. Well, not just stupid, but the, the, the last four, I'm saying about Juno, because the last 48 hours, it, all this has really popped up heavily, right, with the Bloom stuff. and the that, Yeah. It's really come into, into, into the window, into view, but it's looking like it's looking like the exact plan I described to Brian of what I would do if I was going to put it under cover, and now I'm kind of worried. So, mm. anyway. Well... Put that aside for the moment yeah. and assume the best she's that she's not undercover. She's just self-sabotaging or whatever you want to call it, spiraling. I'm sure there's a dozen terms for it people use. That's exactly what I said to Brian. She needs to spiral in the public view is what I said. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's like, anyway. the, it's like the departed, right? Where like they exactly. know that he's a cop, so he gets fired intentionally and is down on his luck for like a year, and then they get, he gets picked up. Remember what happens at the end of The Departed, though? I, I remember the ending, yeah. Everyone gets shot in the fucking head. Everybody. Yeah. <laughs> so Besides, uh, no. Besides, what's his face? Besides uh, Marky Mark. Yeah, Marky. Yeah, that's the problem. I'm Who am the I guy in this? That am I Marky in this? Yeah, yeah. You have to come shoot me in the face because I'm Matt Damon. Nah, no, you're not. You don't Matt Damon's so. the cop who's undercover. Oh yeah. Wait, if you're no, calling not, yourself I'm Matt Damon, because... there's a lot of questions I gotta oh, no, ask. Right. All of a no, no, yeah, Damon's the worst one. He's got like. Damon's no, the no, 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 corrupt no. cop. You know, no, you know, I'm not. I have no fucking. Nobody even knows who the hell yeah, I am. Yeah, you don't have any uh, friends like that. Who would you no, even be no, corrupt no, for? No, it's not. It's not like that. You're right. I, I, it's not not Damon, but I wouldn't be DiCaprio either. Who would I be then? You'd just be some schmuck in the office who didn't get a name. You'd be some asshole in the office who didn't get involved enough for a name role. Does that make you... Does that make, yeah, that's pretty much... This makes me true. like the chief, I guess, who gets killed. You're the guy that gets... Yeah, you're the guy that gets thrown... I'm sorry, you're the captain that gets thrown off the fucking top yeah. of the building. Yeah, sorry, man. I'm like the one person in command that knows her identity and knows the truth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's not exact one-to-one, -one, but... No, but it's it's kind of... Yeah. Close. Any other questions, though? I mean, I, I can tackle that, I guess. Or, or I'm just going to have to sit down and ask her straight away. I have to. Yeah. If she says no, then she lies to me, and then it's on her. So. Yeah, if, she's, if, she, if, she, if she won't tell you to get help from it, then what can we do? Yeah, and I can explain it in full context to her, because she already had the context, because I'm sure Bass and Brian approached her about it. I'm, I'm almost yeah. positive. So. But uh, I've talked to Tessa. I've talked to Dark. I've talked to... I have, uh, Libby a little tiny bit. She was really busy, and I, it, you know, that was just kind of in passing. I wouldn't say talk to, but Dark and I had a good conversation. Tess and I have talked. Um, 
I talked to Willy, just, just a lot of command and stuff, trying to... My biggest thing right now is I really want to bridge the gap again. I really want to get us back integrated into the UPD and, like, off the island, especially with high command. I, I want... I, I, I don't want to say constant contact, because that sounds like I need hand-holding, but uh, just open channels. I, I really want it to be two-way communication, because it wasn't, I don't feel like, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I think Brian relied a lot on just going to the very, very top. And in that, unfortunately, the people in the very, very top did not disseminate very well. So it became kind of like, I thought I told people, but those people didn't tell anybody else. And he wasn't beholden to anyone else, so he didn't tell anyone else. Um, actual questions, though. And the actual questions are, there's a lot that I have that are very specific. And ultimately, I don't really care about the answer. I just care that it's on the radar for you guys. And that comes down to like various drugs and gangs. Like where are we at with them? Are the people on top of it? And I could probably answer that myself by just checking out your discord and seeing what open case files there are and who's working on what. Um, so the question becomes more like administratively, like um, are there problem people in the MCU that are creating unnecessary drama about the interim position? or are going out of their way to undermine you because they think they have a shot at the interview or what? Mm -mm. Is there anything no, like that? I, haven't, I have not Fuck had you guys. Like As a matter of Discordia fact, doesn't exist. single person that I've talked to in the unit supports me and says, uh, I hope that you get that job. I, I wouldn't want to see somebody else just take it from the outside. So um, I have been told, I was approached, like I said, by, I think I told you this. Aaron Show me Carter the Discordia app on my phone. Hey, Show me I the Discordia you know app. I'm applying for it, but I don't actually Show me the Discordia app. And I, I, I want to work for you, blah, blah, blah. And, Show me you know, the app in game. Which button is it? In the waters, and I said, no, I'm proud of you. I'm glad you did. You should show that intent if you want to move up uh, in the department. I, I really, I'm not going to take any applications personal, so. It's not like that. I don't, I don't, I don't, people should apply. You know what I mean? I don't want to dissuade okay. people, so. You got any concerns? Because you're going to be running this for at least a few weeks. Uh, Like I said, making sure that the channels with high command are open and I'm getting the communication and the expectations from, from you guys. Um, the budget has been mainly uh, solved with Malton. I don't know how much of a budget we're going to need in the interim positions, uh, but if we have it, if we need it, we have it. Um, what time is it i don't i think i can lay at the bottom of the dam for for two minutes uh a wide body charger for the director interim director i need one of those oh, everybody's got a fucking wide body i mean <laughs> that's not even no, something we can uh, give you if we wanted to it's i'm totally I'm totally, it's totally something good. bass was granting and oh, he also gave God. away like four to a bunch of troopers who now have them in their personal name even though they're not troopers anymore like carter so it's kind of like it's almost like random who has a wide body at this point i, I was just i was yeah. totally joking well i'm honestly answering thank you i appreciate you because i'm pretty sure that's more i'm pretty sure that question if you want to admit it is a like i'm joking but no what if we have we have a um we have a um shared that is pretty much what we need every day i don't i, I don't know what i would need a wide body for i don't chase cars yeah. so what's your unmarked policy right now is it still the same with um because the way i read the sops was like unmarked with a purpose which to me means like you need to be unmarked to do something, not just like going unmarked to like drive to an interview. Um, by the way, the storm's about to roll in. Are you going to be here for the meeting or no? I'll be here for the meeting. Okay, uh, we we can finish this up. But yeah, uh, I I'm not going to be able to explain it all in one minute. But we we do allow our detectives, not probation, but detective plus, to uh, do the same thing or to have the same purview as packed. So they can patrol unmarked, right, um, and respond to things proactively unmarked that are appropriate. 37s, calls that would you would want to have an unmarked vehicle. Um, 78s, obviously, they're going to respond if they're unmarked in the vehicle, but they should be changing their clothing if they have the chance to out of their trunk. Um, but that's for all for Detective Plus. Supervisors can roll unmarked. Uh, well... Oh my god, they banned me! A restart got me. Uh, Alright, we, we are back during the uh, connection phase. Okay, here's my here's my thing. With Discordia versus Discord and Twitter or X versus Twatter. 
The only reason we call it Twatter is because there is an in-game application on your character's phone called Twatter. And that Twatter is separate from real Twitter or real X. The reason I call it Discord is because there's a real Discord app, but no in-game, in-character, on-your-phone equivalent named Discordia. It's Discord. We're using Discord. Fuck you guys. We always have been. <laughs> this guy's trying to ban me. Mantis says, send me your NoPixel profile. Fuck you. You're not going to ban me, admin. You're going to have to look it up. Why is the Discord using sense uh, Discord for why is it a police department using Discord for sensitive info? Fuck you. Because I want to. <laughs> uh Okay, what music do I play? Um, whoops, that's not the right, right cue, hold on. Skunkin' yeah, App, thanks for the 10 months. That's my number one chatter right there for the month of August, I think. I don't know, I don't know how it does it. Um, Okay, now I'm connected. Cop cube, cop cube. Me schizo posting my way to number one. I think schizo posting is an inaccurate label for what you do, skunk. I think what you do is shit post. You shit post. So is he gonna fire bloom or no? I'm not gonna fire bloom. I think bloom is the most is one. Okay, there's like two characters on NoPixel that I would OOC say are most like Svensson. And it's Bloom and Harvey in that order. Fuck you, Casey. Ain't it bedtime for little bro? No, she got class tomorrow? What's little bro doing? No, she gotta play some crim tomorrow? You're doing a cop chat, man. Harvey and Ethan. Wrong! Don't say Ethan in the chat again or you're banned permanently. I'm not fucking with you, Sani. Don't you dare. Watching my ass get banned? No! Please don't! Please don't do that. Please don't ban me, Mantis. <coughs> Mods, take him away. Mods, seize him.
Well, I'm saying he, as in Mantis, is a grinder. Happen, I'm sure, is a lovely person. Alright, I'll bite. Uh, I had a bad first day as a doctor. On all these TV shows, doctors hook up with the other doctors and patients all the time. But apparently when I do it, I'm the worst coroner ever. And I'm under arrest. Bullshit double standards, man. Yeah, I think you're ready for open comedy night at the mic, man. Yeah, we can get a ski. You been watching uh, Hard Knocks? Community comedy night when holy shit, that'd be hilarious. Is it that Mantis is out here talking about you gotta grind Valorant to stay in your gang when this motherfucker's grinding 2k to stay in his? Fuck you, broke ass. <laughs> Smoked. Are these people waiting for me to start the meeting? Because I'm just not going to. Not in a gang. Throw up your gang sign. Throw up the gang sign for Toretti. Throw up the Mantis gang sign, everybody. We'll get some O's in chat. <laughs> drop the motherfucker dropped a bag on 2K to stay in the circle. We've been prepping Mantis for shit talking for years, I believe. I've, we've been so hard on him back and forth that I think he's almost ready. I'll play around with that idea. Where's the capture card, Mantis? We gotta see your POV. We gotta see you get 30... What do you, what do you get? What are you putting up? Like, 10 rebounds in 2 points a game? Thank you, Lewis. Now I was actually putting up 10... Uh, 10 rebounds in 2 points a game. Thank you. Now I'm listening. What are you talking about? This guy, you're not holding your own. As soon as you spoke, I put my Who does carry your broke ass? <laughs> I don't 
Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, mask off. No, no more shit on Manthus for fun. Uh, I did see Buddha put up like a 20% uh, a from the three point line the other day. I was watching, I've been watching a little bit from Sab's POV and Buddha's POV. And uh, my god, there are just some shots that Buddha should be taken out of the game for making or shooting. Like, he's like, I saw him go like six and 25 from like the from field goal and three points together. That was it was pretty brutal. It was pretty brutal. Six and twenty five. I just you know, there's gotta be like one of those maybe like, you know, maybe like pass it to Sab or someone. Let him brick one too. You know, that's the real thing. I think Sab should be given the ball more so he can also miss. Cause he believe me, he does miss just as much or more. Seventeen assists. Hey listen, I wasn't looking at the assist stat. You got me. I think as a 2K enjoyer, which means I don't play the game, I just watch Buddha and Sab stream because that's how you enjoy it. Playing the game is uh, not how you enjoy it. It's how you ruin it for yourself forever. Um, I mean, there's just a lot of shots going up that aren't going in, you know? I think game plan, ball goes in the basket. Ball goes in the basket. That's the game plan. That's got to be the game plan. When you get more points on the board than they do, you win. <laughs> Why aren't they? Why aren't they utilizing that? Ski. I think we're in some kind of stalemate where I'm not gonna start the meeting. But they think I'm going to because I usually do start I know, meetings. It's a big turnout. You had to turn your head all the way around. I'm more just acknowledging the like the Mexican standoff we're at, where I'm not gonna start the meeting. We got one minute before we start the meeting, sir. Okay. Yeah. Good night, Casey. Also, my guy. bit might be ruined today, so. Uh, it's fine. Today. I told everyone it might not happen. It will happen, but it's a matter of when. Can it be a tease? I love when I walk in and you're just filing cabinets. It's my favorite. I'm a tease. I do it. <laughs> He's a filing cabinet. This is this is sad turnout. Jesus Christ! What do you mean? This is normal. This is uh, this is this is this is this is less than normal. Was last shift rough? Uh, it died off quick. I'll be honest. We uh, fucking was... recapping already. No, I, I mean, uh, it was all right, but before the end of the shift, like, I had like two people come to me and like, what the fuck is up with today? Everyone's just groggy. I don't know. Oh. Oh no. <sighs> Hello everyone, welcome to uh, my meeting. Uh, yeah, we've got like four you? or five new SDSO They're, uh, deputies. The second table. Who's that? SDSO. I'm, I'm Redmond. I'm, yeah. Redmond, Redmond, any relation to Darkmond? N no. Or just Why don't we make him come up here and introduce himself? That's okay. what I do. That's exactly what I do. Okay. Nice. Correct! You, uh, I, hope you have a, uh, I hope you have a bit ready, because that's kind of what we do on this, uh, a this, bit? this meeting. A bit? Yeah. You gotta have a bit. You don't have time to prepare? Get up here. Yeah, we don't Tell care us about who you are, I something about yourself, about and uh, give us a bit. Vibe check. Oh, my God. Okay, well, hello, everybody. I'm Marcus Redmond. I'm a DOC sergeant and now SDSO cadet. I've been with the prison 18 months and decided I'd finally step up to the big leagues and come see how you guys do it. Um... A bit? Like just any bit? Yeah, something yeah what's your gimmick? Yourself, yeah, what's you my gotta, gimmick? Everyone, everyone's got a gimmick. Besides that time that you said that Mine's I shoot an MP7 from a bike. Okay. Mine's 9-11. Oh, no, the fact that you remember that. That's hi. painful. Hi. Hi. My, uh, my best sure. friend is Deputy Warden. I should have been here on 9-11, oh, no. Vincent. Uh, everyone walked out of the room on my joke. It was bad. Mm. Okay. Hi, I don't have a joke, but, you know, I'm the best at what I do and everything I do. I mean, I look good okay. doing it, too. Uh, That's just oh, boo, boo. Second, oh, second, oh, attempt, second attempt at a bit. Second attempt at a bit. Come on. Right, man, don't disappoint the SDSO Objection, here, please. Narrative. Oh. Sustain. Do better. Perjury. Do better. You need to do a bit. Okay. You, you stepped into my fucking here. den. Okay. You're gonna okay. abide by my den rules. <laughs> Fine. Why does dry like that affect you at work? Are you doing a joke? Is that what yes, why? Yeah, why? Because I don't have any elbow grease to put in it. That's uh, it. That was uh, terrible. Uh, yeah. 
That was great. All right, and your joke taste is terrible. Say, that was you come down. Down. Everyone, calm it's down. Tomato. His bit was obviously acting like Harvey Holden. It's fine. <laughs> oh, uh, it's no, funny. do not I'm put so my sorry. name. I'm getting to think there's a running, running thing in the UFC. Hang on, your husband. Redmond, are you talking shit on Corporal Harvey Holden in front of his wife? I was. She's laughing. Kiki, let me have this. Let me start. God fucking damn it, Kiki. <laughs> she's married to him. She either laughs or she, she laughs. cries. I'm safe. Yeah, I'm no, no Is she crying? Is she crying because you're talking shit about her corporal husband? I've worked with Harvey a long time. Veronica, are you crying? Sorry for your loss. Are you sad? <laughs> Sorry okay. to do that. Are you, does it upset you that people oh, are making fun on, of your husband? Oh, come on. Don't be like that. Depends I'm on allowed person. to say that because Harvey oh and I God. are friends. Okay. Have you all ever noticed that, um... Bullshit. Harvey didn't have friends. I raised my hand when Harvey's Walton said, friend. who likes Harvey? I raised my hand. That's There's a difference sad. between liking I Harvey. More like Fartby, am I right? Friend. Nice. Oh it's always God. passive God. gas, am I right, guys? All, all the fucking time, honestly. Come on, not even here to all right, defend all right. himself. Well, we'd, we'd say it regardless. <laughs> it I know you would, but gosh dang it, at least let him oh, be in the room. Veronica. I'll call him. This is the last thing I'd ever say, am I right? Oh, fuck me. What? Anyone else notice that Music videos really fucking started sucking after the 90s, right? Like, what's up with that? Like, Ski! Yeah, once anymore. MTV became reality Why would you TV, watch a music they all video? just went like, downhill. What's the point? Uh, music videos are well, so that's the point, fun. right? Is that they're, yeah. they're shit now, and you don't need to watch it. Like, no one's they're creative anymore. Shit. It's just strippers and no, they and blow I love, I love and the ones that have a good like story. Music on television. Well, the art alternative is you get the fucking Wallflowers one headlight music video from the 90s, which is far from a banger. I don't just... know anything about what you're saying. It's true. Uh, dude, let me well, tell you guys. That's because you're yes, right. VH1 My little cat. MTV yeah. existed. I don't I'm know if it still does. A... MTV was music My little cat was napping on my you're desk all week. Right. On his little snot yeah, towel. Yeah, but I was allowed to watch TV, okay? It's so nice. Um, and that's why one of us had a fucking master's degree actually, at 16. You know, Kurt. You're so the nice. Only, you're the only one with the wow. true Kurt. But, so reach uh, over and pet him. Shit, all these bundles and shit, you might as well fucking be paying for cable. They did the math, it's cheaper for cable right now if you want to watch everything. It's kind of fucked. Who watches everything? Stream everything? Nobody watches guy. everything. I well, exclusively pay for you. You say that, you say that, but people, so, they, they subscribed to all the fucking I've got the chillest cat in the world, but they I'm so want to pumped about it every day. Me, so check fucking mate, cadet. He just hangs out. Yeah, You're really bringing the vibes I, down like fucking Harvey over there. I just, I just leave the wow. family. Okay. He just sits here in his little towel. Oh god, sports guy here, am I right? Yeah, but you How are the uh, 68ers with Ski. the uh, Cardinal Yay. hat going? Yes. If you see me, you gotta ask try to have hockey. to say Is what's up, Ski? Uh, uh, it's already again? quit, so the, entirety po the entire populace of the uh, basketball care has left the PD. Who wants to watch really grown good. men just fake injury? Might as well just watch I, soccer. Hey, really basketball is pretty fun, so... It's basketball. football season. That's why, that's why hockey's just. Better. I'm so excited for Aaron Rodgers this season. Oh my god. Oop. Oh my god. Really I can't wait. <laughs> it's gonna be so good. One. Don't spoil the games. I haven't seen since Monday. Okay, you have it on oh, tape. Poor, okay. poor it's a great soul. game. Ten out of ten game. Yeah, I'm gonna watch it later. Oh, you poor, poor soul. Uh, this one time I was uh, working a night shift at uh, at my previous job up at the news at LSBN and. I was just sitting there with my coworker, and I told him. Uh, Mantis's ass is, is not showing up to meeting at 2 a.m. He's a big Patriots fan. I told him Ain't I no hope way. Tom Brady breaks his arm uh, oh on the next God. play. Uh, and he looked me dead in the eyes, and he said, uh, "If I ever have children, he hopes they uh, they get cancer." And I've oh never God. laughed harder. Like oh holy. Said Tom Brady said that. No, no, the my coworker. I can't believe Tom Brady said that to you. That was the funniest wow. fucking shit I've ever heard. Holy shit! Some people are just way too invested. No, I, I, I thought that was an appropriate response personally because I was trying to fuck with him. <laughs> Holy fuck! God, just thinking about that makes me laugh. If but yeah, arm, uh, let I think he has keys finally. though. You're really not happy until people are wishing death upon you. What if I just took his keys though? <laughs> you know me too well, Anna. Nah. You know me See if he watch shows up first. Uh, yeah, something about yeah. some about people getting angry over something they shouldn't just really tickles my fancy. <laughs> oh, the next God, James yeah. Randall, Dominic Toretti. Upset over something they shouldn't. That'd be sick. Pineapple on pizza. <laughs> No, no one's that stupid. All right, cool. I just don't like the texture of the pineapple. You should eat whatever the fuck you want, because who cares? True. You should listen to whatever music you want, as long as it's not Alien Ant Farm. You should, uh... 
fuck is alien? Yeah. I don't know what question you're asking, alien. baby blue six six nine. I don't know what you're asking. Cover and that's and uh, in the song movies, it goes a little. What bit like is this? this? A meeting before everyone goes it out to work? Like yes or no? The yes. I don't know. And now you've heard Alien Ant Farm. Oh God, I'm yeah. so depressed. Why would I just listen to Michael Jackson? Exactly. Skin. Well, well, if you had, uh, if you held the same <laughs> values as you do to everyone, then that's why you wouldn't listen to Michael Jackson. The meeting oh that God. everyone's having right now like to pick is it before everyone goes out to work or no? Oh, saying that Michael Jackson no. is half of what he was accused of. Uh, Wrong. Not good. Um. Hey, Edna. I missed yesterday. Did anyone do the bring your yes, sister to work day? What? Jordan says hi. Uh, she's anyone? Saying, have a sister. Uh, I don't have a sister. Someone must said hi. Uh, just do what everyone else does and just go adopt one. I got two kids. I don't need. No, I'm sorry. I, 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 I have three kids. I have three we, kids. Guys, stop. we we have to stop this at some point. Please stop adopting other adults. I'm I'm asking yeah, you guys. Pretty bad. I can't tell you not to legally, but please just. They're adults. You don't need to adopt them. You can just be friends. Do you want to know what's worse? Uh, it's all called of my a kids chosen are older than family. Me. That's all. That all is of my worse, kids Kate. are older than me. Yeah. It's worse that you. That's weird okay that you would admit to that. Weird. Well, they're all they're all fucked up in the head. And <laughs> <laughs> no. That's no, not a mom. That's... For a sister. I think no. you're just a dominatrix like a to them, Gates. No. What? No. I am not That's sleeping weird. with Percy Weaver. Well, who would? Oh. Yeah, that Odessa? bar is pretty low. Wait, what? Odessa? Not Clefaxi, his girlfriend. Oh, Odessa okay. He claims her. I haven't seen right. her in years. She woke up. She's been waking up again recently. She's wake up. Out on shit. Put, her, put a little makeup. Yeah, who was it the other day? Someone, is it someone in this room that was surprised I knew the lyrics to that song? Uh, I must not have I been. I wasn't here for that. Must not have been. Uh, there was a doctor on duty, so that's how I'm I know it was. I'm actually surprised mind. that you know the lyrics to that song, because I know very few people who actually do. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Put the keys up on the table. Yeah, one or two. Um, Kurt, you ready for your bit? Yeah. All right, anyone else got anything? Uh, my Like I said, my bit fell short. I was really planning on it happening today. So, uh, sorry for not having anything prepared to drag this meeting on 45 minutes, but, uh, I'm sure I'll think of something. It hype up this Where's Barrick? I talk. I hyped it up while saying it might not Asleep. happen, so don't you fucking do that to me, Lucy. Don't you Barrett goddamn do that to me. I'm pretty excited about I'm the next excited day for it, but... Yeah. What, yeah. What, what, like what would you like you're me to on, relate You're to on him? duty every fucking shift, Lucy. You're not Tell gonna miss it. I made it. another video for Cadet Training. He's, this one's even better. Okay. I'll let this one's evidence. I did oh. take a picture of blood on the ground. Yeah, like it's ready and showing and up. I punched the guy so Coward. Blood, so it's actually his blood. Fucking <laughs> pussy. It's fine. Oh, it's it's come up here first. Or, uh, well, it wasn't or consensual, but he didn't Or Kirk mind. can. But Lexington, I suggest you do it. Come up here, Lexington. Nice totally didn't. Yeah, yep. nice one. I like that, Lewis. Yep. That was smooth, yeah. Yep. Like, job, you just say job. you had a fucking bit and you're in your MDW? Yeah, what the hell's is going on? Bit? Is that your bit? The fucking baiting bloom bit? Crazy bit. Crazy bit. Is the, the whispering far away from me so I can't hear you bit? I'm just seeing Kirk Do you want to follow Song of the Day? And I'm telling you now. Yesterday's Song of the you've, Day you've, took like 20 minutes. You got me excited for a bit. Okay, yeah, and guess what? Guess day. what? Daisy's yeah. got to do a bit after you because she's late to the meeting. Mine. I'm going to say it. So Daisy's Come going on. after you. you. Daisy, bit? hopefully you have a bit. She's walking She's out. That would have been a good bit if she just was like when he's so <laughs> right, like, get on up here. I remember when he <laughs> said that. Miss, miss that opportunity. You know what? Daisy. Mantis is going for a two-hour ban. He doesn't show up. I didn't hear what you guys were saying. Not gonna well, lie. Mantis is getting a two-hour ban from my chat. So uh, unless he shows up, like he hope said you're ready he would. Come up on the podium and do your bit after. After I'm sick and tired of the lies and manipulation. Thought I would offer to be your sister, but I'm already related to half the DOJ, and I don't want to close the loop. I won't take it anymore. That's fair. That's fair. I'm, I'm putting sure my foot down. He's a maniac. Everyone forgets well, the about Tingle's family yeah. tree. Do they DOJ is not each other family, or does that kind of dissolve over time? Okay. I thought those Tingles just reproduced by budding. Oh, shit. Well, no, because they married. Remember? Yeah, we tried they... We tried a lot of animal single. It never took. Why? Fingle Dan what? really huh? fucked up with uh, marrying like Mental Block. Who Who's out? Oh, that's the whole point Michael Simone? Okay. So how it works is it is a picture of somebody. Um, it starts at 25 oh, grand. So sure. The more I have to expose before you get it correct, the money will drop by five grand. Nice, per photo. it's like reverse That's strip a good poker. Bit. Wait, oh. did, okay. I, did, I, have, oh. did I go on a date with this Do guy? You have the money I hope I not. I, yeah, I, I do. Like I know I, who it is already. I, I, I Saint Clair. I just have stuff. money. Okay, no. so you no. are. Go ahead, and <laughs> I will take three guesses. If it is incorrect, I will expand the photo. 
Oh, okay. Uh, uh, Tuco right Senior. I don't actually know at all. Clark, that was mine. Fontaine. That's not all right. Fontaine. I'm going to be expanding well, the photo. We're like down Fontaine. to 20 grand. Looks like Fontaine. I can see it's it. It's the fierce eyes. The hunter. You mm -hmm. the hunter prey eyes. You ever hear that? Well, the problem is it has two eyes. So that's how we should have known. Yeah. Should have known. Like, I don't even notice. It's like she's got two. No, it's not Fontaine. Dominic Toretti. Oh, yes. I was going to guess Turbo Ash Lad from the last okay, one. You have one. Maybe think about it, not just blurt it out. It's all uh, with a stupid ass face you're, tattoo. You're, you're down yeah, they, to one last it's, guess it's, for this. It's also, I it looks it. like it's, it's a criminal. Could you uh, tell this person to smile more? <laughs> hey, kiddo. They can smile with their eyes. I don't know. Yeah. Is, it, is it a. Who's that Never guy? Know. Part of the. Is it Mayhem? Ooh. Ooh. Okay, warmer. You get one last guess, one last mayhem. name, and then we expand it. So the mayhem that was just murdered in prison? What? No, it was the other way around. I don't Who's know what I promise Joe Biden. Oh, she's on the phone. <laughs> That's a great guess. Ooh, yeah, we love MDW during this or no? No. No, no MDW. Image no, on MDW. Google. no MDW. Hey, kiddo. Just at the meeting. I am smiling right now. Thank you, Bear. I said maybe. Huh. I like this bit, Lexington. This is good. You know what this is, Lexington? I'm already going to call it. No one on Shift 3 knows who the fuck this is. Am I well, right? Well, you should, because he's around on Shift 3. All right, I'm going to okay, expand Okay, all right, it. then never mind. All right. A lot of people will come over here is and it Gabriel Navarro? Oh, that's not, not a big expansion there. That's no, not that's a lot of new info. Oh, wait, sorry, that's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. That is not a big expansion. You're right. Like, identified by what? Nose hair? Oh, all right. It's BFC, right? Do I know someone that works at Hayes Harmony or Autos? Yeah, I feel like I can accurate. see his name. I mean, that's I don't know his name. The entire city. I'll say it. No, I don't. There's a half face. Like, I can. Oh, like that. four people that look like this. I can oh, confidently say this guy looks like everybody I've ever seen boosting a car. Adams? Yeah, exactly. The driver. Oh. The driver. His name is the driver because okay, that's all they you, call him. I will give you right, one tip. He is an active warrant. The no one, no MDWs. Don't fucking MDW, pull out your shit, no. dog. Dude, oh, the he's MDW. the fucking Liz is on the MDW. He's fucking what? He's the sheriff. You can't tell him not to. Well, I'm not gonna guess. I just don't know. So I'm looking. I, just I won't say. His fucking name. He has white hair, doesn't he? I fucking his know. Warrant's gonna expire. God, I, I have seen this. I bet he's wearing a red line race jacket or something. I have face blindness. Oh, he's a racist. He's a racist. That's who that is. He's a racist. They're all racist. All right, you get one more name, and then I'm expanding. By the way, you're down to ten grand. God, I hate this reverse strip poker. I don't know what the fucking name is. I don't know enough people's names in the fucking. I don't even see him here. Okay. I'm looking. All right, do you want me to expand it? Expand it. Take it off. Okay. Take it off. Ancient putting it on. Nice. Oh, King? they don't have any hair. Prince. Okay. No, he has white hair. No, Adam he has Prince hair. doesn't have he has white hair at the top He's left. got a five That's head. Adam Prince. I can tell you that for is a fact. Is it this guy? Yeah, he does I have a five head. That's what's right. I never would have gotten this. I don't know who the fuck this guy is. Be Adam Prince, but then you add the makeup, and it's no longer Adam Prince. Our left. I never would have guessed this guy. I don't know who this is, and he's got like face paint on. Okay, it is not Adam Prince. You get one more guess for a name. If I expand it again, you're down to five grand. Tanner Johnson. Okay, Sis Fulker. <laughs> Max Muller. It's clearly, too, it's clearly Julio Thomas. Oh! She got it, right? No. No, damn. Oh. Damn. It's what Stanley looks like under the mask. That's not true. Oh, I don't know who this is. Ew. Ew. Ew! What is that thing? Wow. It just I looks like it, it just looks like every third person I've ever arrested for yeah. racing or boosting. Yeah. That looks like Sharpie. <laughs> Are we sure that's not Sharpie? It, it, it looks like, I hope it looks this person, like his hair glitched. I'm gonna admit. They need to sue their barber. I hope this person learns about this bit and realizes okay, just how much he's getting. <laughs> I'm gonna admit. I'm just. I fully admit. I'm cheating is this, and is I don't see him. Somebody who would be upset if it's the first who... one. It's the first one, Spencer. No way. That that's so. That guy looks totally yeah, different. That looks radically different. This is this that is a, a, a lesson of do your job and a reminder of a warrant all in one. Redline racist. Oh. God damn it. Uh, Tony Corleone. Okay, so you've no. all lost. This uh. is him. Oh. He yeah, really that, has... still don't know. We all know who it is. That it's doesn't insane. mean anything. To me. This is this is Travis okay. Lott. Uh, who the hell is that? Who? 
Oh, I know sorry, a Taylor, Taylor lot. Taylor lot. Taylor lot. Still don't know. Okay, I, know, I actually warrant. met him the other look, day. He look have a at warrant. me. No, he does have a warrant. Uh, look at the wrong. first person. That's no, it Travis. Is. Wrong. He doesn't have a warrant. Wrong I'm not looking right at it. Are you sure that's not Travis happened. King? That's Travis King. Well, that's not Travis King on the board. That's not Travis King. On the board. Yeah. But the no, first, the one the, the Maple was saying, that's Travis King. Travis King. Okay, this yeah, person Travis. does have a warrant. Taylor Lott does not have a warrant. <laughs> you dumbass bitch. This is a base. Maybe it just ran out. <laughs> hey, look, Yogi, okay, I might be dumbass bitch. No, what if you I'm bought it anyway? No, I'm trafficking against him. That's it's a great idea. Well, I didn't remember wrong. him. Hold on. Hold on. I want to say, it's a great <laughs> idea. I love it. But it has to be someone we might know. Yes. Well, well three, to be, to he's be a fair, British baller. How are we supposed to know? To be fair, he's had three warrants this week. Okay, fair enough. I mean, yeah, I, I'm not shift three, so I never went on this guy. Your expectation is that people are gonna look at the warrants. This guy's a British <laughs> baller, though. How would shift scheme. three know him? My girl knows. Look at the warrants. Look at the warrants. A British baller is like saying a wet water, right? Okay, look, all of them are British now. This is my I'm saying. I got, I got a. This is a good bit. It's a great bit. I love it. It'll be better for tomorrow. I love it. It's a great idea. It's a really good one. It'll be better tomorrow. You know what I mean? How often do you get a resounding good bit? Is Rayla here? I wonder if Vish knows this guy. British Bala. I feel like she might. Rayla and Bear. Ask her. Or Decay if he's here. Is that him? Big T? Big T? Is that Toronto? Oh my God! Callow? Is that Callow? He showed up. Oh my God! Oh my God! Well, it could still be Callow. Holy shit! It could still be Callow. You can't Oh, it doesn't sound at all like Callow. Doesn't he have dark? Can you call from refused to take my keys. Oh, I got you. I'll do it real quick. No, don't do it. Oh my God! How do you do? Do not do that. I'm pretty sure I once found and got you. Are you like hiding in the meeting? I don't see you. No problem, man. I got you. Fuck things up. Please don't do it. It's gonna fuck things up. Please. No problem. You're civilian now. Uh, you know, if you, I was a I DOJ, God, I'd be upset with it. you proposing you it that way to me. But I actually idea. have common sense and know what you're asking. You. Where is it? I you submit it. Thought I was just doing what you wanted, yeah. sir. You did everyone. Did you just fuck? No, I didn't. God, you. You're such a. Don't leave. Don't leave. Don't leave. Too easy to fuck with this guy. I think if he still Who, thinks um, he's in his pocket. Who's it all? <laughs> that's, that's, that's how that works. I think you have to sign out. Too easy. You have to suspend them too. I'm not on duty. Wait, I just you're have late. You don't work here. What do you mean? Wait, 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 I, I, under, wait. I got that. Freddy, you're late for the meeting, so you have to have a bit. He has to have a bit. Yeah, he's late. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, it's time. Oh, 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 it's time. Oh, it's time. Oh, it's time. All right, your bit, Freddy. Right. Yeah, that was her bitch. She just Yay. didn't have one, so she left. Well, Hello, everybody. Uh, as you know, I have uh, retired. I am still retired. Uh, great news. Uh, what I've been doing while I've been retired lately is I joined a rec league. Uh, Did someone playing basketball. call Shelby his handler? I think oh, he's lost. Wow. Um, uh, if you couldn't tell, my I'm a little bit uh, taking a little break. Uh, I've been icing my back, sitting in the sauna. Uh, I put up. 30 and 30 uh all day today Bullshit. was rough ain't no way uh we were just talking about how no one cares about basketball big t well <laughs> except that i, I said i do up here. except um, i said i do care about yeah, basketball. Well, i'm have just telling you about what i'm doing this is what They're i've been doing did you get your horse stable while i've been gone i listen no, man no horse stable. what if what someone tells one? silas that you're here bragging about basketball who's he's gonna come put you in your place who's your team big t medium t whatever you are now i have my own team my my rec team well it's it's uh, it's Lang Buddha. Uh, that guy's a criminal, and I hate him. Yeah, he is. Uh, he's I'm he's targeting just, that hey, man. Honestly, Bloom, if you saw him on the court, you would know how much of a criminal he is. He's 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 Ayo. made plenty of criminal acts on the court going nice. over 22. Yeah. Anyway, uh, yeah, I got uh, Lang Buddha on my team. I got Al Sab. I don't know who this guy is. I think who? Oh, Al Sab. Yeah. That's a car. He, he he used to run like a tow company. A car. He's He's, right, that uh, one got me. He, uh, he, whatever. Uh, and then is these two really... guys that are friends with uh, Lang Buddha. He's, he's guy sounds nice like guys. he's 5'6". Are you supposed to be that, tall to be on a basketball team? Ghost on Mount Gordo? Isn't there like a sign that says like El Sab or something? Uh, maybe. I have a picture of it. I read this thing all the time. It says El No Sab. What does uh, that mean? Believe it or not, El Sab is a person, no Sab, not a car. El no um, Sab. I know. He used to own a tow truck company. Yep. That was like, he's like a tow truck guy. Yep. Boy tow. tow truck well, guy. That, that's what I also I've been gardening. Uh, I'm getting uh, into gardening. If you need, nope. 
not okay. drugs. That's ridiculous. Why would I be doing that? I'm actually going to be starting an herb garden. Well, the reason, well, to answer your question, why you would be doing that, herbs. What, what's that, Blue? Uh, well, the reason you would be doing that is because you're either a cop or a criminal. There's no. Well, no, way. I'm. I'm not a criminal. I don't. Holy shit. Criminal act. Wait, so. Which one am I? Well, do you uh, siphon don't... power from your neighbor to fuel all your TVs or anything illegal like that? No, 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 no. Did, did, I, did one of your TVs uh, randomly go out like maybe an hour and a half ago? Uh, I, don't, I mean, I have so many of them sometimes yeah, I can't really uh, keep track. I just thought I heard maybe like. Do you? Yeah, no, never mind. Do you all drive right. 35 at all times to stop for every red light? All right, you're right. Maybe I am a criminal. I'm a bad boy. What can I say, guys? Thanks, I'm Jessica, sorry. For the Just tier like one. Down in the post. I'm Appreciate a bad, it. bad, bad tier man. Tier ones are oh, oh, right. some anyway. are on a discount or something, I think, right? Huge. Uh, <laughs> Anyway, uh, I just wanted to stop by. You know, I was up. I had nothing else to do. I just felt like I would come by and uh, you hear that. Hello. The only time Turdy showed up to a shift three meeting is when he's bored. Well, I would just. Oh, he was here once. I mean, I'm not a cop yeah. anymore. I mean, otherwise. When do you even put Silas would... on your team? That guy was always the best player we uh, ever had. He he. Uh, that guy dunked he, on he, you so many he times. He forfeited. He forfeited. He's afraid. Well, I don't know. Last he's I heard, scared. he was up by ten thousand and five hundred wins. No, well, he he actually forfeited ten million wins uh, today. Actually, so he I'm, gonna, I'm gonna call him about that. Silas was your boy, you know though. I'm gonna email him. Okay. Good luck. You think Sleepy Silas is up right now? Well, I never thought Sleepy Ray would be up right now. I'm always up. I got stuff to do in the house. I feel like that's innately not true, having had emails ghosted by you before. Me? Ooh. Yeesh. Ooh. Well, Called out on the spot. I, I'm usually, okay, that's not fair. <laughs> there's, there's a lot of emails sent to me, okay? It's hard to... Not anymore. Oh. <laughs> that's true, but that's... you also have not sent me an email since I retired, so I don't know what your... Well, I don't know what well, kind of defense that is. Judge, but yeah. <laughs> Yeah, sorry, I also talk to important people now that I'm a judge. Oof. Oh, yeah, but why would you? And what if you ever? Already, I, mean. I don't understand. Yeah, I, I mean, unless you need tips on on your your post defense or how to grow uh, giant watermelons, then uh, I don't know how I can help you anymore. I mean, I guess the years and years of police experience going through all the ranks and running a DT department to help build the department up and then being chief and then the we're starting a new department you, yes yes it did mm. here we go he built silas for what where's uh where's for axel what? dead oh he's dead, dead. and i'm running Big for commissioner dead. again yeah he, well died. Lieutenant. he died he died deputy commissioner yeah. he, he died live on LSBN. stream yeah yeah, yeah. yeah they, they he, uh, the he went into prison during a 35 man jailbreak or riot and huh. they executed him live on camera in front of the entire city yeah, I wouldn't so call that like valuing personally, but he traded himself okay. for like 13 <laughs> PD and DOC. So he's kind yeah. of a hero, I guess? No, no. no, no he, no. he definitely went no. out a hero. Did he get the guys out? No, he, he yeah, he got him out. out. He went out, get him out. Did they surrender yeah. afterwards? No, no, absolutely not. No, but he got the injured out. He got the injured out. He died a hero. He got the injured out, so it wasn't for nothing. It was a hero move, for sure. All right, we need to get those grenades that they have that are the Hornet's Nets grenades. They used to throw them at us in college, uh, where they, it, the, you throw, this, it's like a grenade, and you throw it into a crowd, and it just bursts into a bunch of pellets. What the fuck are you talking about? about? They call them the hornet's nests. You talking uh, about stinger uh, grenades? Like a, yeah, they did it all the time. Like a stinger grenade, a college. grenade full of rubber pellets that you... Yes, that's it, oh, yeah. Why not just an actual nest. grenade if they're murdering people? That seems that's a, a little excessive. All right. For college. Uh, I feel like an actual grenade boring. would rectify the prison situation. I think we should all right. I feel like, uh, I feel talk like to my gun guy, them. but I don't think we can just I throw grenades in there. Teredi, if you just throw a grenade in there and my son dies, I swear to God, I will sue you for if your If you're executing the commissioner, we're going to be throwing grenades, you bet your ass. What are you talking who's about? Your, who's your son? Jordan Elmore. Who's older than Never her. heard of him. Like but anyway, need to have we need to... Never, never heard, heard of you. him. <laughs> That's, that's a lie. True. He definitely yeah. has heard of me. That's Come a on. Lie. That's a lie. <laughs> that's a lie. <laughs> the streets talk. We all know. Oh, Come on, God. guys. He probably doesn't even know who I am. All right. Uh, well, that's uh, that's all I got. I, I didn't expect to come up here and say that I was just going to come by. Did you come uh, now I've just found out that? Axel's dead. I, I feel like that's a, just read a the bomb news. that's just got... I don't I don't have time. I got... You don't have time to what look at your phone? Time? 
I got guys, gardening to do. You own your phone ninety. Guys, guys, I got a please. Tan. I got Teretti's a pool to take care of. Teretti's obviously been spending a lot of time with Shelby, and uh, let him let him have his the vacation. horse in the meeting. The horse has terrible. do not have a horse. We do have a horse. He does have a horse. It's she, blind and deaf. It. Blind deaf. It's got hit by two cars. Two? Uh, the other day, yeah, oh. I got hit by two cars. Oh my god! I, it jumped the it jumped the railing. I told this the, is why you need to raise your fence and get a proper stable. Well, it, you know he's like fell the animal cruelty. He's a little mad at in, me. In Canada, we just call that a hot dog. What? Okay. What? I, what? I, I don't know what that. What you know what? We're gonna move sense? on from that. I've never I'm not heard sure of what that, that before in my life. What? But the horse is a little upset with me because uh, when I tried to give him his arthritis medication. Uh, he can't see very well, and he started eating my hair. He thought it was the hay, and I had to slap him because I told him to stop, and he didn't. Freddy's life is so oh, fucking weird. Oh, my brother called me Tommy. Wharf? Hey, oh, Tommy! No, not Tommy, not no. Tommy. Tommy, where are you? No, John oh, Nefroski. Tommy. Stop it, John Nefroski. Check my Discordia? That's not what okay. it's called. Discord's it's called Discord. It's called Discord. It's just yeah, Discord. Yeah. Discord. All right, Discord. I'm checking. Look at your phone. A... Look at your phone. Do you see a Discord app? My... Wrong. Thank God okay. my sheriff agrees. Uh, are you coming Holy by? Fuck. You can't sue me for oh, saying I got Discord. Some. I'm sick. They can't say. Oh, they can't sue us for saying oh, Twitter anymore. Uh, it's, like, well, it's like saying Ventrilio. Not yet, but I just found out the other uh, commissioner's dead, so we might need to have more interviews. I'm, I'm ready what for you like, mean, we? What do you mean we? You're retired. You don't work here. Yeah, Alright, you gonna come by? Good. Everyone's uh Bloom is very scared of you? What? You hit him no. with some playground style? No, not scared, just Desert I Eagle just playground be... style? That's a you don't have a <laughs> what? <laughs> Imagine Tominetic. Okay, I'll Desert Eagle on the playground Tom... style. Tominic Toretti. Christ. All right. Uh sorry, that's my that's my little brother, uh Tommy Toretti. Little bro, yeah. Yeah. What? New commissioner, huh? Never heard of this right. Uh, okay. Well, I'm. I'm just gonna. It's nice to see you all. Uh, mm -hmm. I hope everyone's doing well. Uh, Everyone. Uh, it looks like uh, Bloom is no well one cares that he still has a MP7 on him. You have uh, a, everyone. Everyone, make you sure you have an Uber or back to your retirement from home? Shelby. He's really. Uh, uh, I, I'm not in retirement home. I'm still. Well, I'm still young. I'm is your caretaker gonna be here to take you back to the home? I'm 35. I'm not even that old. You need me old. to put him, send him to Parsons. I can get the orderly to pick him I up. I would love to go back to. Oh, you not heard right him now. Do not put me. Make I it so. Are you consenting? He said he wants to. Toretti, Toretti, if you have a, such a problem with it, just come take it. Oh. I'm not a cop anymore. Just come and take it. I'm yeah, right there it is. The admission. Why are you here? Just a, a, then why are you here, I'm old man? I put my, uh, I put my whole life into this. To this place i can't come visit you guys get in line see me ever? Yeah, but then you abandoned us oh, i said yeah, thank you you. Here right now. you know what okay fine i'll leave i said thank you for taking out your busy schedule hang out with shelly oh, oh. No, don't say that maple it's fine oh, i once i once found him uh not worthy of his girlfriend in court it was really funny oh it's okay she moved on to bigger and better he'll come back he'll come back it was Could lily pond she moved on to now? bigger and better um are you making a Dick size joke about Bloom? No, I'm saying Bloom's a better boyfriend. I don't boyfriend. think Gates has ever seen my cock and balls. Uh, no, I haven't there. seen yours, well, but I you have tell seen... us what your shoe size was. I did see another cops, but I won't tell you which You know what they say about guys with big shoes? Lost in variety. Big and... socks. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, big socks. They have to special order their shoes off of the internet? Unfortunately, oh. they, they make me come and uh, kill two cows and skin them myself. Wait, they make you come oh and then God. kill them. I'm <laughs> so yeah. glad that you finished that what sentence because fuck? that pause was... Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. It's a shame. Oh, yeah. Size 18s. I fucking hate it. Um, Thanks for bringing up trauma about my feet and uh, my cock and balls, Gates. Thank you. Uh, Is that why you're into feet? Size 18 is massive, oh, dude. Speaking of which, uh, I hope everyone's uh, on duty for this upcoming uh, Shoeless Sunday. Hope everyone's on duty for that. Don't uh, let don't let Jackson Bones in. He's a fucking foot freak. I don't even know who that is. Bones. It's it's uh, Jeffrey Bones' older brother. Oh fuck! I've met that guy. Oh, yeah, I do right. know Jack. He's in the feed. Jackson, He'll jack off Jackson. right in front of everybody. Good oh my lord. God. Oh my god. Yep. Uh, I'm oh saying be god. careful around him. He's a freak. He's just like Wayne Thunder. Can we let him do it? Because then we can just send him to jail. But no. 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 What? It's not indecent do exposure not... unless you touch yourself. 
by well, he, law. The, yeah, but we're talking about touching. He's touching himself, Gates. Yeah. yeah, so you gotta wait for him to touch himself, and then you can send him away. Let's just not even get wait, to that. Man. Let's just I mean, not let him around. Yeah, I think the intent is enough. Just don't let him in. Don't, don't let him in. You can, right. push, you can push charges off intent. Shoeless Poor Sunday, test. though, guys. Nobody's being You keep those to yourselves. Cross. Look, I'll deal with him. You heard it. You heard it here first. Keep your penis. Actually, wrong, Sandy. Hey, go. Lexington's got. You wait for Trom. Trom bones. That's gonna be the best bones. Up, Tessa! Everyone, give it up to Tessa! Yay, hey, Tessa! Yeah. Hello, everybody. Hello. So, um, Trom Bones is gonna be hopping off. I have a little um, Ranger event coming up on <gasps> Tuesday. So Tuesday the nineteenth at one p.m. Pacific. That is four p.m. Eastern. Dude, Bozo keeps um, hitting my mouse with his Bank fucking Arena. tail. We He's swinging that out, shit. So, uh, we're gonna He's do swinging that tail. There. Uh, it's specifically, though, we'll for people who are Bozo's controlling the mouse right now. in applying Bozo for the cat. Park Rangers. So, Ooh. if it's something you're interested in, uh, I will be announcing a little application form. You want to look over there, uh, Bozo? That's anyone fine. Anyone who's planning to go, I would appreciate it if you'd fill it out. Um, and yeah, that's kind of all I have. Your cat Mac would get his oh, shit hey. rocked. Thank you, that's exciting. Your cat Mac would get his shit not, rocked by Bozo. Not really country. On God. Exciting. Sorry. Oh, sorry. She's been doing that a lot. I, that's crazy. Oh, sorry. That's I I Foster. don't I don't get to ban him because he showed up. You know what? Uh, who, he avoided who the ban. Who Derwin? How to listen? Anyone in here? Why? I, 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 I told this well. fucker not to put my name on the search warrant. Just put a space and I'll sign it if I see fit. And then he just signed it for me. Fucking oh. freak. Oh. He signed it for he you? Just riddled with spelling errors. Oh. Well, oh, he's Australian. Lord. He doesn't know how to speak English. I read one <laughs> earlier that I was like, I was. <laughs> oh. I, had, I read one where I had to double check that the people knew you know how to speak English. Kylie, English language. It's different. Kylie, just. I'm going to take a picture of my little cat. I don't mean post Sterling it in my Discord because right. you guys have been good, you know? A little bozo picture. Call me Bloom. God is a, like my father or something. Um. <laughs> At least that's what they say. Kurt, you ready, dog? You just snapped. Oh, yeah, he ready. did. It was a finger gun. It wasn't a snap oh, gun. Okay. It was a snap. snap. It, w it was a snap, but it was oh, a finger gun. Snap, gun? snap yeah. and a finger gun. Talking with but all y'all talked talking over him. The snapping was the problem, but not talking over him. So I couldn't even fucking hear what Kurt said. Hey, Kurt, are you ready, buddy? Yeah, I've been ready. All right, come it's on up. Time. Let's let's get this no. thing over. Who's in my Discord? Who's in Discord? God fucking damn it. He's gonna snap one day, Kyle. You know you're what's gonna be, gonna be funny ahead. is that one of these days he might actually do Despacito Hi, and nobody's he gonna did. know it. He did do oh, it one right. day. Here well, we go. He I never did. No, day. no. I did the Spanish for the day Despacito. Oh, yeah. And I'm, I'm completely ready for you guys to what pick apart even mean? everything in the picture. All right, here we go. First line is. Free bird. We L O L back and forth on the text line. What a fucking zoomer song. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm fucking I hate it We L O L. I don't know this one. Over the yeah, phone on the I text line. Know. Fucking, how about yeah, put a gun know. in my mouth? Pull I'll it. I'm blank. Final answer. <laughs> right with you, honestly. No. I hate it already. This Friday. That's not like. That's not like breakthrough. Oh my god. It's a Friday? Wait. Oh no, I think I actually know this. Let's say it, Lexington, prove Just how much Just crop out your shelves. No. Are you already out of yourself? You get yeah, money for it. it. At least get paid for it, darling. Now you can see the duct tape, uh, the saline nozzle yeah. nasal spray. <laughs> There's a bullet in that picture. Uh, and Bozo's apple cat hat. Oh my gosh, she actually knows it. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck, oh Lexington? I made it really like it. the Black Eyed Peas as a teenager. Holy shit, okay, I was not I don't expecting that. Let's get it started, but the actual so, title, huh? Am I right? To give you the uh, oh yeah, it is just getting context, started, but... uh, he's basically I'm like pay me this time? just oh, to I the right of me. He's like <laughs> <laughs> just sitting next to me. That's true. You don't... Oh, 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 Lexington! Wow. That's you that's can't cool. rip some Black Eyed Peas and then assault a man or batter a man, rather. Why not? To be fair, I stopped saying I'm paying for people like two nights ago. You cheapskate. Yeah, did you just say you had a budget? Yeah, he hasn't been paid though. I, yeah, I haven't been re-upped. Oh, yeah, have you reached out to 
Context of the bullet budget. showing there. Um, oh, shit. I don't know. I, I, gotta do I, I have some bullets. I what the fuck? Put them you, back what, in the what could you possibly yet? have to say to bring the mood down? There you go. Here's some oh, haunted photography like, from the dog. There's new charges. Dog. No, okay, guys. Oh. Y'all know how you all have the same access to done. everything? Announcement done. There you go. The fucking pay it. attention. There you go. That's him sitting that on my chest shit. like a even read on the third green like a screen. fucking. That's just because Kylie's eyes are upside down. You insensitive <laughs> asshole. <normal> entity. <laughs> <laughs> I'll no. have you know, Kylie actually writes reports I can read. That's yeah. because your eyes are upside down too. I bet. What does that even mean? Aussie She's eyes. Australian. Australian. I know, but I'm clearly not. What the fuck is that bullshit Reggie's twatting out? It's true. It's one says South related. of Olympic. Yeah, it's so, true. So, one says South of Olympic, the other one says North of Olympic. None of them cover actual Olympic. It's I'll just, the charge guess what? Guess what? I'll just articulate that it's South of one lane of travel and North of the other. Fucking idiot. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's going to take it to bench. I look oh, forward well. to the first Yeah, DRS. Yeah, Reggie taking something to the bench. I'm fucking afraid. Oh, no. Uh, just a word of advice before we go out. Reggie tries to run, like just get you scared in the cells because he's not actually good at his job. He just yells. Fucking take him on anything. He's a bad lawyer. A All right, guys. Um, he's any more bits before we go out there? He's, he's a here. terrorist, serial killer, freak. Yeah, uh, and he's still not the worst. We oh, wait. Thought. I have one more announcement. Come on up, Lexington. Have you met? Never mind. That. I'm not supposed to talk. I made it earlier today, but I might as well make it during the shift too now. It's the shift three now, not two now. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> no, no, you fuck you. Okay. Um, okay, wow. so yesterday, uh yeah, yesterday Kamali made me search or clean out his locker. Uh Ooh. in doing so, uh it was two oh, years worth of garbage hey, and so sex of toys. Um so that being said, turns out I'm oh, really man, good at organizing right. sex toys no, and your lockers. So for five right. Right, everybody. I will organize your locker. I'll right. see you next time. Oh, wow. Fair enough. Okay. Bye, Sensen. Bye, Sensen. I will organize your lockers for 5 She's offering to organize sex toys. So if anyone has a locker full of sex toys, um, and also conveniently has a PD character, um, good luck. Hey, uh, sir, you want to wrap that talk up? Yeah, what's up? I think we're pretty much wrapped up, to yeah. be honest, but just to make sure the bases are covered. Uh, brought some new people in who've been waiting a while, promoted people who've been waiting uh, even longer, uh, trying to improve morale and uh, communication inside the unit, and then to high command. That's pretty much the first steps that I've gotten for. The next steps are going to be reorganization of the case files and uh, better, how do I say, it? better prioritizing of what we're working on. You have one of my badges. Okay, that's good. I don't think it's got to be like a wrecking ball situation. I think we've got a pretty good foundation when it comes to everyday uh, operations kind of thing. Just can be improved, and there were improvements in the works that just, again, fell by the wayside. A lot of it's from the war, you know? The the day-to-day -day operations of the MCU kind of shut down, and we became more of like a military intelligence unit almost, so. Uh, what Owens is this? Cow dance. Mantis, what is this? Thanks, Flash, for the 17 months. I think I'm pretty good where I'm at, and uh, going forward, as long as there's no other concerns or anything with the uh, folks I want to bring in new. Who do you want to bring in? Tommy Malarkey, Jessica Williams, Avery Stone, and uh, Cohen Riker. Who are the first two? Jessica Williams and Tommy Malarkey. Okay, yeah. I don't really know those people enough to have a problem with any of it. Yeah, um... I mean, background, Malarkey is Bundy's son, but he doesn't want anything to do with that being the reason he gets in the unit. Uh, he does good work. He's already involved in PACT with the LSPD, so he's got unmarked experience, undercover experience, and uh, proactive experience, which is what we're looking for. Jess is a great all-around cop. Um, she's also a, one of our FTO, well, LSPD FTO, and uh, has had interest for quite a while on everything. So, yeah. All right. Well, sounds good. I got no complaints, so I guess we'll see how... The next few weeks go and then interviews yep yep so what, what you're saying weeks for the timeline to actually sitting down for the interview well, i'm just being realistic in terms of like how long it'll take to make a decision and have all the interviews and timeline yep. i mean i think we're probably gonna look start scheduling stuff um this weekend and do interviews next week and then by the time all the interviews are done it might be like more than a month to be honest
I'm not sure. Yeah. We're also going to do the PIO position, and uh, for me and Stubble, the, P, the PBSO lieutenant. Yeah. All right. Well, I uh, this weekend, Saturday, I, I might not be free. Well, I'll well, have time. I'll, I'll make we'll, space. We'll, we'll work it out. You know, it's not okay. like... Yeah, sorry, I'm jumping. It's not like do it this weekend or not. It's, we're, we're still... There's plenty of time, you know? Yeah, yeah. Uh, just, to, just to clear with you, do you have a problem with the interim director wearing plain clothes and patrolling plain clothes? It's in our SOPs for the <clears> supervisors <throat> as well. I mean... I only have a problem with detectives in general responding to calls exclusively in that uniform. If um if you're yeah. if it happens because you're in you're in that uniform for other reasons and you you end up going to something or you're plain clothes for a reasonable purpose that's fine. If you're going to seventy eights and like bank robberies and clothes like that, then you should probably get changed first. Oh, that was what we were going to try and that was the discussion we were having. You asked me yeah. here. Uh, I'll just open this real quick. What the exact uh, SOPs and uh, the exact day-to-day -day operations of unmarked versus UC. So undercover is very rarely used, as you can imagine. I mean, you're assuming another identity, you, you're changing clothes. I mean, once in a while, we have somebody rolling around undercover if it's a, a known bust or op, but generally it's unmarked, you know, that we're, we're rolling around as. So we have the same SOPs and they were written um, and shared with PACT. So PACT and, and the MCU have the same exact SOPs when it comes to unmarked patrol. They can both unmark patrol at the detective level and higher. Uh, they're expected to not, you know, it's an expectation to not do that the entire shift. Um, they can go out there and do some, some just like the pack people, right? Same exact stuff. I'm, I'm sure you're more familiar with that just because it's, it was more frequent. Um, supervisors can, supervisors can be wearing, so there's a difference between plain clothes, right? And like business casual. Um, is that, is that something that's delineated as far as high command goes or is that seen as the same thing? Mm, plain clothes versus well i mean i think the only difference between business casual and plain clothes technically is the badge on your head right because yeah. not all not all business casual is plain clothes but all plain clothes would be business casual you know what i'm saying does that make sense like um <clears throat> yeah if you're in plain clothes if you if you're in business casual you are in plain clothes you just have a badge at, on your hip or on your chest or whatever you're right whereas you know, if you're in plain clothes, that can sometimes even mean casual wear. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm i more okay with the detectives wearing a vest, you know, slacks, a dress shirt uh, around the stations, around a courthouse. Um, if they have a vest on and 78s pops around them, okay, sure. But yeah, they, they should be pulling over and just grabbing their, their uniform out of the door. Yeah, exactly. Just quick on the way to 78. If they're at the office or courthouse, I don't care what they wear as long as they're professional and identifiable as a police officer, at least in some way. But if they're going to a bank robbery or a boost or 78s or anything where they're now responding as a patrol officer instead of a detective, they need to be in uniform. That's so, the general rule. Okay. that's I, And we can amend it to be that. Right now it is not that. It, like I said, both PACT and the MCU detectives, if they're quote unquote patrolling unmarked, which is allowed by the SOPs, they're allowed to respond to patrol calls as an unmarked unit in, in their clothes that they were, as long as they have two forms of identification as a cop and they're not the only unit on that scene. Um, yeah, but it feels kind of like people are going to, I mean, I, I hope it doesn't come to this and I don't want to make an issue out of something that isn't one yet. Right. But yeah, I'm patrolling unmarked and then a, a boost call goes off and I respond to it. How does that really, how, what does that have to do with being a detective at all? You know? Agreed. You're not, yeah, you're not, if you're not you're in your detective duties, you should probably just be in a uniform. It's the same thing as Agreed. HSPU where... You can patrol as HSPU, but if an HSPU call goes off, you need to be in your. You, you, if you, you you know what I'm saying, like if an HSPU call goes off, like an S plus boost or an S plus plus boost, mm -hmm. you're expected to be responding in your interceptor, right? That's allowed. Yeah. That's always always has been. But if you're responding to like a house robbery and you show up in an S plus mode, then people are gonna be a little upset, right? Right. Yeah. Absolutely. Um... Yeah, I, I don't want to push those limits, right? I don't want I don't want privileges to get taken away from people if they're twenty four seven in plain clothes and unmarked because we don't need people patrolling like that twenty four seven. Um, I, I think those were more tools that were going to be used in the cases of areas of high crime, um, you know, kidnapping stuff where you want to keep a low profile and try and get, um, you know, a better a better vision on it. What was that explosion on Popular Street? 
Never mind, it was autos. All right, we're good. Um, so yeah, I uh, we are also we are having a big well, meeting with the supervisors. I believe circle. Tuesday, this coming Tuesday, we're gonna review the SOPs and do some more revisioning and maybe uh, put out another version of them. So not not okay. a huge change, just small revision. So um, obviously, I like to get the word out to High Command now. It'd probably be good. It's almost a almost a week to give them heads up that. Uh, if anyone wants to be involved from high command to be there and chip in on those SOPs, I, like ideas, we're not, we're not expecting people to write them. We're going to write them, but yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you let us know. You use a certainly channel or something to let us know when you're yeah. going to do it. We should be there. We'll do. Like someone's unmarked right now. And I'm like, you know, I don't know. I mean, actually, never mind. That's just someone who just bought a Taurus. I'm pretty sure. But the main thing for me is I know that it's like a bonus for people who, um, really you know like they need like an incentive and so like you know wearing being special in a special car or a special uniform is great mm -hmm. but like what's the practical application between being unmarked in like you know i mean i could be yeah unmarked or whatever but it's like whenever you want um yeah i mean it's just like if you're going to like a standardized call then you should be like you know what i'm saying if you're if you're going to something as a detective and you're investigating a 37 or something and then something happens and you just don't have time to get changed, that's one thing. Yeah. Or if you get changed or stopped or whatever, then you'll lose the suspect, that's one thing. But if you're just setting out to patrol, kind of like, not randomly, but, you know, you're just, you don't have a real destination in mind and you're patrolling, and then you go to a boost, it's like, why why do we need a detective car here? What, what purpose is this serving other than confusing Air One because there's no number on top, confusing other officers who are newer and don't have the same understanding of what police cars look like and sound like, et cetera. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they don't generally the detectives aren't responding to 77 requests uh, for stuff like that while they're in that like role unless it's they're the only units that can respond. Right. So, again, it's always extenuating circumstances. The problem is that it leaves a very big gray area. Um, I think I need to try and help define it a little bit more so we don't see that. Also, that person, I have no idea who that officer was and I they're not a detective. So I don't know why they're unmarked. I, not, nothing to do with me. Might be packed if they're LSPD, but um, Anderson. Oh, well, there you go. I, yeah, nothing to do with MCU. Um, the only one that I've actually seen driving around unmarked besides myself recently, and maybe the, no, not even, not even the supervisors, uh, it would be Bobby Russell. Yeah, so one supervisor, and I've seen Aurora doing it quite a bit. Um, I already had a chat with Aurora and let her know that she probably shouldn't majority of the time be in an unmarked car with business casual clothes and a vest on, and that was happening. I'm also trying to set a better example myself. And so, I mean, I, I could probably get away with wearing plain clothes a lot, but I'm not going to, right? I, I just want to set the example that they should just. Be... I mean, it doesn't. I'm I'm not trying to make this overcomplicated, and uh, I've read the SOPs, so I know exactly. You know, there's a lot of goodwill suggested in those SOPs, and so far there's been no issue. So I'm not trying to make an. I'm not trying to make an issue that isn't there. Mm -hmm. But you're asking for my position on it. This is my position. Absolutely. That's what I think it should be. Okay. Yeah, no, I I. I want that feedback. That's I'm not like enforcing my will or, you know, like I, you know, no, obviously I, I don't, I there's only been a few grumblings about people that are like, why is everyone unmarked all the time? Personally, I'm not like, it's not the biggest deal in the world, but you know, that's, you're asking my opinion. This is my opinion. Yeah. I think it's just a, like kind of like a housekeeping thing that I'll have to help reel in. You know what I mean? Just be like, Hey, make sure we're really using it when we need to, or else we're going to lose it kind of thing. Just a quick yeah. heads up, if you will, to the yeah. folks. That, and it'll probably be more targeted towards yawn. the folks they see doing it. So yawn. But anyway, all right. Well, I'm going to, I guess, get out there for a little bit. I'm actually probably going to go and put on some plain clothes and roll around and see what happens because there's been some 37s going off. So. Okay. He's fucking trolling. <laughs> Banned for two hours again. All right, man. I'll catch you later then. Yeah, yeah. Sounds good. Unless you want to roll together for a while. I don't know. You going out there? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. All right. Getting late. I should probably try to get to sleep so I can wake up at a normal time tomorrow. I've been yeah, off sure. kilter for a little bit now. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm going to be around tomorrow much. Probably late, if any. Uh, I say that I'll probably be here for the meeting. Who knows? All right. We'll see you then. Yeah. See ya. Thank right. you, sir. Appreciate see you. Man. This fucking guy, dude. You know, you try to give a man a chance. You try to give him a chance. You think, all right, he, he betrayed you once. But this time, for sure, he's being real. This time, for sure, he's going to be a man of his word. And he's not going to fuck me. And then you know what he does? He fucks me. 
It's a three hour ban. I'm not going to see that guy for a while. I just... I feel hurt. I feel betrayed. I yawned at that guy. I yawned at poor Luca. And, uh... He scammed me. He scammed the shit out of me, dude. <sighs> okay. Uh, I'm done. Thanks for, the sh thanks for watching, guys. It's been a lovely stream. But, uh, my head's hurting again. Ibuprofen's wearing off. And, uh, it was gonna be a short little stream anyways. So... It was a lovely stream. Thanks very much for Wookie making it a memorable one. Thanks for sitting through the sponsorship. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Fuck you, Mantis. Um, I hope to see you guys soon. Maybe tomorrow, maybe the next day. I'm a little... I'm just now kind of getting over this uh, being sick thing, so... I'm going to try to get back more into the swing of it in a few days or so. Trying to take it a little easy. All right. Um, is anyone live worth rating? Aurora, yeah, Aurora got off before I called her this the first time. I tried calling her like an hour and a half ago, but she wasn't on anymore. So, I figured she went to bed earlier than she said. Um, why is the chief streaming Hell Let Loose at 2 in the morning? Alright. Alright, um, I'll see you guys later. I don't know what the fuck this guy's doing, but, you know, it's always a good time. Uh, see you on the other side.